what's up with a happy Roblox family? So happy, so, so, so happy. With mom, dad, Daisy, Molly, and the baby. Cute baby. La, 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 la. <laughs> Cute little baby. La, 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 la. <laughs> We're the Star Squad smile. Just a tiny bit. <laughs> Don't forget to hit subscribe. Okay, everybody be quiet. Be quiet. The um, weather is about to come on, and I want to see if school's canceled because we're supposed to get a bunch of snow. What? We're supposed to get a bunch of snow again? Ugh, so much snow here lately. Yeah, but it means we get out of school. Woohoo! It also means that we can't go to school and learn anything. We're gonna be so dumb by the end of the school year. Dumb schmum. <laughs> Sleigh riding! Hot cocoa! No homework! Attention, please. Attention. We are experiencing a small delay. Okay, okay, we fixed the delay. Oh, oh, there's still no visual. Ugh, oh, I hate working for this Brookhaven news station. Uh, sir, you're on air. <laughs> that was so unprofessional. Okay, what, what's happening, what's happening? Um, uh, sorry everyone, what I wanted to say was we're supposed to get another six feet of snow. Six feet of snow? Holy guacamole! Wait, did they cancel school? Not yet, Molly. They're probably waiting to see what will happen. Girls, come on, it's time for bed. Um, Mom? Yes? Mom, we, we don't have to go to bed right now. We can stay up late. What? Why? Because we're not going to have school tomorrow. Well, did they announce that on the news? Uh, no, but they said we're going to get like another six feet of snow. Six feet? Oh my gosh, it's a ton of snow. Why did they cancel school? I think the news reporter was kind of crazy. I don't think he was even knowing what he was talking about. He was complaining about Brookhaven News on live TV. Oh, hmm. Well, maybe we should get ready for bed anyway. You might still have school. What? No, I want to stay up late and watch a movie. Please, Mom, please, 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 please. Molly, oh my gosh, no. All three of you, go brush your teeth and get to bed. Okay. I don't know why my mom's making me get ready for school in the morning because, you know what? We're not even going to have school. It's going to be so much snow. <laughs> We're not going to have sn any school for a week. It's going to be like snowvid. <laughs> oh, I'm exhausted. What a day. I'm not. I'm not even tired. Molly, you're yawning. You're totally tired. Wait, don't forget to turn off the light. I'm always the one that has to turn off the light. Well, that's because you're the one that's always the last to go to bed. I'm not even tired. I'm not even tired. What? What was that sound? It sounded like a cat. We don't even have a pet cat. <laughs> Must be just a dream. Definitely not a dream. What is that sound? I think it's coming from downstairs. I'm gonna go check it out. What is that? Oh my gosh, it looks like a crying baby Kira cat and mom, are you a cat? Okay, I must be sleepwalking. Time to go back to bed. Definitely Daisy was right this time. I need to get some sleep. morning already <sighs> look we got snow daisy wake up omg but it looks like we only got a couple of inches we'll probably still have school daisy i had the craziest dream last night daisy are you ever gonna wake up Ugh, i can't believe how lazy she's being this morning daisy ah! daisy you're a 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 what meow you're 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 a cat uh, of course I am. Meow. 
What happened to you, by the way? What happened to me? What are you talking about? I was never a cat. Neither were you. This is just so crazy. I don't know what you're talking about. I've always been a cat. You must have gotten a bonk on your head and you have amnesia. But anyway, we're going to be late for school, so get going. What? No, this, this can't be right. Wake up, Molly. Wake up. Wake up! Uh, Mom, something crazy is happening. Mom! 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 Ma uh, oh, my gosh. It wasn't a dream. Baby Kira's... Baby Kira's a... A, a, a kitten! Meow. Of course she is, Molly. Wait. Why aren't you a cat? What happened to you? You, 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 you you're human. Of course I'm human. Why are you guys cats? Meow, meow, meow. Does she speak? Does she speak human? Well, she's working on it, but she's still a kitten. You want some milk for breakfast, or maybe some delicious tuna fish? Ew, gross. No, I'm just gonna go get dressed, and and hopefully when I get to school, everything will be back to normal. I think I might be having like some sort of amnesia or 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 i don't know maybe maybe everybody else has gone crazy it can't be me that's crazy right it just can't be it can't be i bet mrs smith isn't a cat oh gosh yes she is meow plus milk equals purr oh my gosh this is the craziest day ever well i guess i better go in there and face the cats meow good morning molly you're late sorry mrs smith is that your name of course it is. What's gotten into you, Molly? And why aren't you wearing ears or, or your whiskers? She's not a cat for some reason, Teachel. Oh my gosh. Well, I have to take 10 points off your grade then. This is cat school. Meow. Oh my gosh. I just got 10 points taken off of me just because I'm not a cat. Well, that doesn't seem fair. Like I had a choice in the matter. Okay, everyone. Today, our theme is... Meow plus milk equals purr. Let's hear everyone do it. Meow. Milk. Very good, Daisy. Now, Molly, let's hear your meow. Um. Meow. Um, <clears throat> oh, my gosh. That sounded like it was going to shatter the glass. That was the worst meow ever. I can try again. Oh, my goodness, I don't belong here. This isn't for me. That's right, it isn't. You don't belong in Brookhaven at all. You're not a cat. Everybody, we should ban Molly from Brookhaven since she's human. Fine, if you don't want me in Brookhaven, I don't need to be here. I, I didn't like it that much anyway. Goodbye, daycare. Goodbye, Brookhaven shelter. Goodbye, school. Goodbye, Starbucks coffee. Oh my gosh, I guess I kind of did like it here, but who cares? I don't need you with cat people. Oh, I'm freezing. It's okay. Tomorrow I'll set out and find a, a new town that's not full of cat people. I'm just so cold. The snow is so cold and the sleeping bag is not meant to be laid on the ground. Just, just, I hope I can survive. Well, I did find this burrito from the garbage. Mm. It's still pretty tasty. Hey, you. Ah! It's a giant rat! Oh, I don't like rodents. I don't like rodents! I'm sorry, I stole your burrito. Here, you, you can have it. You can have the burrito back. I don't want your burrito. I just was here to tell you I I know how you feel. What do you mean? I'm always the bad guy in cat world. I'm a rat. I get chased. I get my tail pulled. I have to try to eat out of the dumpster. It's the worst. Yeah, well, I'm a human in cat world, and... and I guess I'm an outcast. Me too. Sounds like we're going to be the best of friends. Come on, I'll show you where I've created. What do you mean, what you've created? I've created my own town. Seriously? Wait, what's it called? Rat World. And you'll fit in. But I'm not a rat. Doesn't matter. You'll be my friend, so you'll be cool. Come on, I'll show you. Okay, well, goodbye, Brookhaven. Goodbye, family. Goodbye, smelly, crazy cats! We're here. Come on. Um, why are we going into the sewer treatment plant? Where do you think Rat World is? Um, I was hoping not in the sewer treatment plant. Come on. This is the entrance. Just follow me. Um, Mr. Rat Guy, I think 
think I'm changing my mind about going to Rat World. Why? Because you fit in so well here? Come on. It's your only choice. Well, here goes nothing. The entryway to Rat World. Oh, there's a rat already. Hi there. Uh, welcome to Rat World. Yeah, we're so glad you could make it. Um, thank you, I think. Uh, it's kind of smelly down here. Really? We don't smell a thing. Yeah, well, you guys are rats, so you probably don't mind, but I'm human, so I sort of do, but I don't belong in Brookhaven, so I guess Rat World is my new home. <laughs> My Alma watches. Too bad, I'm watching Survivor and I'm trying to chill because I just had like the longest week at school ever. I'm so glad that it's finally the weekend. I brought my Coco Melon. I want my Coco Melon. Oh, baby Kara, go talk to mom. She can entertain you, but not me. Actually, um, Molly, I have to work today, so um, you're gonna have to watch baby Kira. Wait, what? But, but today's Saturday. Sorry, Molly, but uh, you know the hospital needs me sometimes on weekends. Well, what about dad? Dad's at the station. He's, he's gotta work today too. Oh my gosh. Well, that's okay because I still have another sister who can watch you, baby Kira. Daisy, baby Kira needs to get watched. Sorry, Molly, I have my dance competition today. Oh, why didn't I take dance? Instead, I'm stuck with a little baby sister. I like being stuck with me. Well, that's because you're you and you don't know how annoying it is to be stuck with a baby sister. Molly, be nice to your little sister. Just look at it this way. You're so grown up and responsible now that I'm actually leaving you home with your sister. Are you going to pay me money? Molly, no, she's your sister. I'm not paying you to babysit her. But mom, that's not fair. If it's a job, I should get money. Ugh, Molly, call me if you have any problems. Fine. We're watching Survivor, baby Kira. I don't want you, and if you don't give me what I want, <laughs> okay, okay, just just stop screaming. Here, we we can change it to to, to Coco Melon or something something that you want to watch. Okay, um, let's see if it's on. Uh, uh, please be on, please be on, please be on. Um, baby Kira, um, Coco Melon isn't on right now. I'm really sorry. Yeah, but look, there's little puppies. Don't you want to watch them? Oh, wow, wow, puppies. Okay, well, let's go outside and ride bikes in, okay? That'll be fun. It looks like it's a really nice day out. Come on. Okay, i go with you. Now, baby Kira, leave the training wheels on, okay? Because you you haven't learned how to ride a bike yet. I big girl, I don't need those. Yes, you do. Leave them on. No. Yes, or you're going to sit in time out. Oh my gosh, I should be getting paid a million dollars for this right now, seriously. Okay, come on, let's go. Watch out for cars, okay? Stay to the side of the road. Whoa, big kid, how about you my brakes? Um, okay, just, oh my gosh, are you okay, baby Kira? I can't stop, what am I gonna do? Okay, just don't quit pedaling. Oh, okay, teaching her how to ride a bike has been, well, really hard. Whee! Baby Kara, don't go in the pool! Oh my gosh. I thought you were gonna ride your bike into the pool. What are you doing? I could go into the pool like this. No, it's not warm enough to go in the pool, baby Kara. Get down right. Oh my gosh. I have to go in the pool after because she's not even a good swimmer yet. I drowned! I drowned! Okay, hold still. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Hold still. You're gonna be okay. Here you go. Get on my shoulders. Oh my gosh, it's freezing in here. All right, just stay on my shoulders. I'm gonna ride the bike home, okay? Actually, why don't you ride your bike home? Come on, baby Kara. We gotta go home. It's time for dinner. I don't want you. I, I, I gotta stay here forever. No, we have to go home and eat something. I'm very hungry. Come on. You're a mean babysitter. I'm also your sister. <laughs> so what I say goes. Now, come on, let's go. I just wanted to watch my Survivor show and relax for the entire day. But no. Baby Kara, are you behind me? I'm coming. Cheaper creeper, you're so pushy. <laughs> My little sister just called me pushy. Come on, go up this hill. 
Too big, can't go out that hill. I go up a different way. No, come this way. Come on, it's time for dinner. Can we have pizza? Um, actually, yeah, we can have anything you want as long as you don't scream ever again. All right, I'm just gonna get the pizza and put it in the microwave. I want mine cold. Ew, yuck, that's disgusting. We've gotta put it in the microwave. Um, I actually, I didn't mean to like get in the microwave myself. <laughs> Okay, baby Kara, I heated it up. Here you go. Ooh, look good. Can we add the couch? Um, no, you have to eat out here. The couch is white and you're really messy. I want to eat in here. No, baby Kara, you have to eat out here. Come on. Oh, I hope it's her bedtime soon. I really hope. I'm fine, pepperoni. So pick it off. No, it poisoned the rest of my pizza. It didn't poison the rest of your pizza, baby Kara. Just eat it. Why are you being so mean? Ah! Oh, please, somebody rescue me. Please, please, I need rescuing. Ah. Wait, I know. I'll call mom. Hello, Brookhaven Hospital. How can I help you? Uh, yeah, I want to talk to my mom, please. Is this Molly? Yes, this is Molly. Okay, hold, please. Molly, what's going on? Are you okay? No. Baby Kara's driving me crazy, Mom. You have to come home right now. Well, what's going on? She didn't want to have pepperoni on her pizza. Molly, I have to go in and go back to work. Call me if there's a real emergency. Mom? Mom? Well, she hung up. Come on, Baby Kara. It's time for a bath and a night-night. No, I want night-night. I hate night-night. It's night-night time. I go by you first. And then I splash in the water. Ew, gross! Don't splash in the poo-poo water. Oh my gosh, now you definitely need to get in the tub. Come on, get in the bathtub, honey. Get in the bathtub. Oh, I don't know how mom and dad do this. Seriously. Phew, that was a long, long day. All right, baby Kara, come on, get in bed. <sighs> okay, Molly, good night. Good night. <sighs> Molly, could you leave that? I'm afraid. Yes, baby Kara, I'll leave the light on. I know you're afraid of the dark. Finally, my own room, my own bed, and no baby Kira. Huh? What? Who would be calling me at this hour? Uh, uh, hello? Molly, I, I need you to come to the hospital right away. Something's happened. Mom? Is, is that you? Yes, Molly, of course it's me, and ah, my stomach! Mom, what's going on? Are, are you all right? Molly, I need you to come as soon as possible. Um, okay, Mom, I'll, I'll be right there. Did you call Dad? He's on his way, too. And, 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 and Molly, I just can't believe this. Mom? Mom, what's going on? Okay, well, Mrs. Acker, I see that it's not just one, but two. Two, two what? Two, two, two what? Do, do you need to have your appendix out, Mom, or something? No, Molly. I'm about to have twins. What? Twins? What are you talking about? You didn't even know you were pregnant. I know, right? I guess after you've had so many kids, you just don't even realize you're having more. Uh, there must be a mistake. <laughs> she probably just has to fart. She eats a lot of tacos, you know. Uh, no, Molly. Um, this is definitely your mom having babies. Your husband should be here any minute, right, Mrs. Acker? I hope so. Molly, go see if you can find Dad. And hurry! Okay. Oh, my gosh. Mom's going to have more babies? Are you serious? Where's my dad? Molly, too, too late. The babies, they're coming. Come back. Huh, what? B -b dad must be a way out of call or something. Oh, my gosh, Molly. The babies, they're almost here. Okay, Mrs. Acker, I'm just going to need you to push. Okay. Uh, Here's baby one. Molly, why don't you hold your new baby sister while I deliver the other baby? Um, okay. Um, this one's crying a lot. Molly, just, just take care of that baby. I'm about to have another. Okay, Mrs. Acker, push. And here's baby two. It's another girl. 
Isn't she sweet? Wait a minute. I don't feel done. There's another baby. I know there is. Wait, what? I didn't see that on the ultrasound. But if you feel like you're going to have another baby, then push. Okay. Uh, uh. Wee! Wee! Oh my gosh, it's another baby. What's going on? You have triplets, Mom. I know, I thought I was only going to have twins. <laughs> and I'm going to have to get back to work in about 15 minutes. So, Molly, I'm going to need you to take care of all these babies. Wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> take the babies home, feed them, change them, get up with them when they cry in the night. You no, know, your dad and I have to work so much. What? No! This can't be happening! <laughs> Molly, wake up! You're having a nightmare. Huh, what? What? No, you don't understand. Mom had triplets and then I got a babysit all of them. Molly, you're having a very funny dream. What? It was just a dream? Yeah, more like a nightmare by the sounds of it. <coughs> what? Who's that crying? It's baby Kira. You were yelling in your sleep and where well, you woke her up. Well, go take care of her. What? No, I've been in my dance competition all day, and Mom left you in charge of her. You get to go take care of her. Oh, man. Well, at least it's not four babies. <laughs>
I need to find a purple key. Where can I find a purple key? I also have a chainsaw, so... Hey, what's that up there? There's a lot to do around here, guys. And the nose just never stops looking for you. Never! Uh, Daisy, what are you doing? Molly, oh my gosh, the nose has me stuck over here. It's like a glitch. And then, oh my god, look at me. You look crazy town right now. OMG. Um, cheesy macaroni. I don't know what to do for you, Daisy. I'm out, Molly. I'm out. This nose is too crazy. Okay, well, guys, it's just me. And wait a minute, where's my chainsaw? What? Oh my god, I lost my chainsaw? Okay, guys, um, so now I'm gonna find the red door again. But don't worry, I'm gonna find it. And then I gotta get my chainsaw back. And, and there's, so, ugh, the pictures in here are creepy. But there's other things I can do in here, too. Oh, there's a noob in here. All right, I have no idea what that means, but I feel like I need to remember the number three, so help me remind, remind me, guys, if I forget. <gasps> there's a red door, finally. Okay, there we go. <sighs> For a minute, I thought the nose was gonna get me. All right, guys, we gotta do this little obby here again so I can get the chainsaw. But you can't get sniffed by an eyeball, so we're safe. At least the last time I checked, I don't think you can. No, Molly, eyes can't smell. Cheapers, creepers. Uh, okay, my sister is still glitching, guys. Oh, my God, here comes the nose. <laughs> you went right by me. That is creepy. That's one of the creepiest things I've ever seen in my entire life. Just giant eyeballs, giant nose. Oh, and we can go into the safe zone if we need to. But I think we just need to go figure out some of these puzzles and also try to get more keys and stuff. Oh my god, here comes the nose! Wait, one, two, three. Okay, wait. Um, maybe I should push this. Okay. And uh oh. Here comes the nose! Ah! Dang it! Oh no! Okay, we're gonna revive. Alright, guys, if you were me, where would you go next? Um, I'm not really sure where I should go next. <laughs> this is stressing me out. Molly, do you want to quit the game? No. I want to win the game. I want to win all the Roblox games. Guys, I've only collected five of the 14 boogers. I'm going to keep running in circles. What am I doing? What am I doing? Oh, it looks like there's some sort of door there too. But I don't know how to... Maybe the chainsaw will break through that? I need C4 to destroy this. Okay, no. What's this stinking old chainsaw for then? Whoever created this game made it really hard. But I haven't seen the nose lately. Okay, guys. The nose is right behind. Oh, I'm losing all my Robux in this game. So, guys, I did figure out the, like, corresponding code. So, like, two is green, three is blue, and I just need to figure out, um, then just, like, press the buttons on those, and I should be good, good to go on that. So, see, like, there's the green number two. So, then if we go over here, you're gonna see, like, okay, I got that part figured out. Go me! Well, let's collect some boogers, too. Ew, gross. Give this guy a tissue. More boogers! I never thought I'd hear myself being excited about that. All right, we'll climb that ladder in a minute. But first, I want to fix these code things. It takes you a long time to get over there. And I'll tell you why, guys. It takes you a long time to get over there because the nose always is chasing you. So we just saw three, guys. Three is green, too. Okay, guys, now's the time when you have to remember what the codes are. Let's do this. Oh, man, the nose is always after me when I come to this park. Oh, that nose is so annoying. Here we go, guys. All right. Pink? Do you guys remember the colors? Green? Yes! Oh, wait. That was just to get more boogers? Are you serious? Must be we need these boogers to escape, guys, is what I'm thinking. Because uh, that was a lot of work just to collect three boogers. But, I mean, I could have picked my nose faster than that. <laughs> I don't need to pick a lock to get some boogers. I need to pick my nose. Uh, but don't pick your nose in real life. That's disgusting. But in this game, it's really highly encouraged. Um, okay. Um, the nose just got me again. We got 11 boogers, though. Can we get out of here when we get 14? Please. I just want to escape the giant smelling nose. One hour later. Found it. All right, guys. Let's see what's up this ladder. Ew. It's like we're inside someone's nostrils. Oh. Ew. Oh, he looks entirely too happy about being so close to boogers. This is gross. It's like being in someone's nose when they have a cold. All right. I guess I'm not... Wait, what? Uh, I don't get it. Is that just like an escape hatch? I want to go over to the other side and see what's up there. Guys, I still have to find something to blow up the wall. And I still have to find a purple key. And I have to figure out what this chainsaw is for. I don't know what it's for. Oh, my God. The nose is right behind me, guys. Um, But let's take out our chainsaw. Maybe it'll be like, get away from me. Get back. I've got a chainsaw there, Mr. Nose. <laughs> oh, he is right behind me. Ah! 
Maybe I can go in here. Wait, I used my chainsaw on that. It's, oh, wait, it broke. All right, guys. It said I needed a chainsaw, and it did actually break it. It just took a second. And now, oh, my God, I'm running into things and trying not to get sniffed by the nose. He, the nose might actually be able to fit into that room, so I got to be really careful. <gasps> there's the purple key, and there's the, the other thing of boogers. Oh, and there's a yellow one, too. I never noticed that before. Oh, my God, I need to go somewhere else. There's the nose. All right, he's, he's after me because I feel like I'm the only one that survived. Daisy, are you still even here? Yes, I'm still stuck at stage five. Where is that purple door? Where did it go? Where did it go? Oh, my gosh. The sniffing nose is like waiting. His eye is on me. I can feel it. Maybe if I just move farther back, he'll be like, ah, it's no, it's no use. She went to take a nap. Oh, my gosh. He sneezed on me. Okay, that's just rude. Okay, there we go. Okay, guys, we're on a mission to find the purple door. Well, there's where Daisy was, like, glitching. Hey, come back! Help! I can't help you. I'm sorry, Daisy. The purple door! Bum, ba, da, da. What's in here? Um, oh, I think that's the explosive. Yes, and also another canister of boogers. All right, guys, let's go out and see if we can blow up that wall. If I can remember where it is now. But listen, guys, um, I would suggest if you're going to play this game, have lots and lots and lots of Robux because... If you die and the nose sniffs you, you have to start all over from the very beginning. You can imagine that would take you forever. Oh my god, here comes the nose. Good thing I have a lot of Robux. <laughs> Stay away from me, you giant nostril. Oh, there it is, guys. There it is. I don't think I can blow it up in time, though. Because the nose is, like, right behind me. Oh, he's being so annoying, too. All right, here we go. Ba-boom! Let's blow up this wall. Oh, we gotta wait a minute. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. <laughs> See if it blows up the nose. <laughs> oh, that would be a lot of boogers. I wonder if that portal is going to open and we can leave. That would be amazing. All right, where is it taking us, guys? It looks like a mate, another part of the maze. And he can follow us down here. Oh, that's not fair. Oh, whoa, where are we going? 14 boogers required. Well, here comes the 14th booger. Dun, 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 dun. Where are we going? Um, okay. I got to pick up a screwdriver. And, hello, is anybody there? I think I have to go back the way I came. A green door. Oh my gosh, the doors just never end. Now what, guys? Maybe we gotta fix the portal or something. I don't know. Doesn't seem to actually be working, so we could go try to fix that portal in, in the big room there. I can't even get back to the portal because the nose is trying to sniff me again. Ah, oh, this nose. All right, guys, is this where we need the screwdriver? That's the question. I need to turn this on somehow, okay? Um, the screwdriver would be very, very helpful right about now. But let's see how we're gonna turn it on. Somewhere there's gotta be something to turn this on with. And I've got a nose following me. Maybe if I just go up into it with the screwdriver? No. Molly, I think you need to find another key. Oh man, are you serious? Yeah, I, I was looking for the last one too before it went. The unfortunate event happened where the nose trapped me forever. Oh, Daisy, I'm so sorry that happened to you. But don't worry. I'm going to escape, and then I'll rescue you. Are you sure about that, Molly? This nose, he's so evil. Don't you worry about it, Daisy. Ha, ha, achoo! Oh, no. You're starting to turn into a sneezy nose yourself. What? No, no. Uh, hi, hi, hi. Achoo! Molly, he's a did you? Um, maybe I just have allergies. Ah, <laughs> oh, this nose will not leave me alone. Molly, look, there's a ladder right there. Climb it. Whoa, I don't think I've been in this ladder before. Wait, seriously? There's the yellow key? Told you, Molly. Ah, oh, you figured it out. Well, actually, I kind of helped you. Well, it's all you can do, Daisy, since you're stuck in that glitchy, like, space in the game. Yes! Oh, my gosh. I just found the yellow key. What is that? 30 and then a green button, and it's counting down. Um, okay. I think I need to get over to the portal and quick. That's what turned the portal on, I think, which means this is timed. Holy macaroni. How do I get back there? I think this is the right way. No, that's not the right way. Oh my god, guys, I think I went the wrong way. It's okay, Molly. You can press the timer again if you need to. Well, I might need to because here comes the nose and he boogered on me. I'm pretty sure my time's run out now. Wait, I, I, did my time run out? I need to turn this on somehow. Well, wait, did my time run out? I'm so confused. 
Must be my time ran out. Guys, I'm so sure that this is gonna turn on the portal. I, I really think so. Don't you, TC? I think you'll bite, Molly. Oh, wait. So you can do this, Molly. You have 30 seconds. Are you ready? All of the booger collecting has trained you for this moment. <laughs> well, I picked my nose long before I played this game. Ew, Molly! <laughs> Just kidding. Let's do this. All right, guys. I pushed the button. I'm out of here. And I gotta remember which way to go. I don't remember. It's counting down, guys. I mean, it doesn't actually show you it counting down, but... Um, I'm just running in a circle. I don't know where to go. Why didn't I get a map? Oh my god. I'm gonna be stuck in here forever, Daisy! Are you ready to try again, Molly? Ready as I'll ever be, Daisy. Ugh, I know I'm gonna be able to figure this out because I never give up. And if you never give up and you never surrender, then you're probably gonna win. Because what other choice do you have when you never give or give up or give in? Yeah, that's what I meant to say. Sorry, I can't write a song and try to win this game at the same time, okay? I'm not that talented. But I am gonna win this game, guys, because I'm never gonna give up. I'm never gonna surrender. Here I go to win the game! Oh my gosh, I just won the escape the experience. Look at me, guys. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. Whoa! I did, Molly. I'm still glitching over here in the corner. <laughs> Chapter two coming soon. Dun, dun, dun! What? The nose! Dun, 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 dun! Away from that noob! Oh man, he just farted on him! Ew, gross! That's so gross! Wait a minute, you fought a lot too, Molly. You eat a lot of bean burritos. Yeah, I know, but that bully is just... He's being mean to that noob! Yeah, uh, and the farts are just, well, gross! Yeah, on top of being a bully, he's also got gas. That's, that's just disgusting. Molly, let's try to escape and help this noob too. Sounds good to me, Daisy. Look at you, nerd. You won't even give me your lunch money? Fine, I'll meet you after class then. What? No! Oh, man, he wants to bully me after school! We better tell the teacher then, because, oh, wait a minute. He's taking over school! Timmy's class, no leaving it all. All your lunch money is mine, mine, mine. Well, Daisy, then there's only one thing to do. Escape! Oh, my gosh, this isn't good. This isn't good at all. Well, Molly, it's going to be okay because we've escaped a lot of Abbeys. Hey, kid, where do you think you're going? Yeah, but he's chasing us, and he's bigger than us and fast, too. It's going to be okay, Molly. Jump up here. Oh, 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 my God. Oh, my God. He's going to get me. He's going to get me. Molly, you got to knock that open. Yeah, there you go. Where'd he go? He's disappeared. He's waiting for us in the future. I'm sure of it. Ooh, I just got some money. Yeah, your lunch money back. Duh. Oh, yeah. He's been taking my lunch money for about two months now. Rude. I haven't even been able to eat pizza on pizza day because he keeps stealing my lunch money. All right. Let's go through this vent, guys, and see if um Daisy and I can escape. Uh, Molly, I would say no because there's a bully right there. O-M-G. I just got caught by the, by the bully. But I wanted that lunch money back so bad. And guess what, guys? When I get it back, I'm going to give it to the noob. Oh, Molly, that's so sweet of you. All right, guys, we got to watch out for all this crazy stuff. Like, look at these pencils. Swipe, swipe, swipe. And basically kill me. <laughs> that's why I think doing homework is so deadly. Oh, Molly, doing your homework won't kill you. Sure feels like it sometimes. Sure feels like it. What is this, paintbrushes or something? I think so, Marley. Uh, actually, I think they're markers. He shrunk us down and made us into this, like, oh, more lunch money. All right, we got, um, three of the ten lunch monies. He shrunk us down, and he's trying to capture us. Because look at this. O-M-G. If you guys think that we can escape this bully school, then slam the like button. Oh, no, the noob is in the locker. That's not good. Marley, he's, he's back again. Oh, my God. He just never goes away. That's usually how bullies are. Pick up and place desk. Hmm, where do we have to place them? I think we have to take them over here so we can get over this fence, Molly. Um, let's put one right, uh, 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 right here. All right, I want to drop this one on top of the other one. How's that going to work? Maybe if I just click drop here. 
Maybe if I stand here and click drop. Oh wait, there we go. Drop. Is it enough for me to get over now? Da -da -da -da. Oh, I've got to do more on the other side. Oh my gosh, this is a ton of work. Oh, Molly, don't be so lazy. Finally, I thought you'd never get up here, Molly. What are you still doing here? You're asking for a beating. Um, not really. Uh, Bully Fortress, stay out. Press a giant button. Press a giant button. Try to escape this bully. Okay, so far, guys, he has not even got me. Not even once. Can, wait, can he come in here? Um, he's not very smart. He's ignoramus. Look at him. He's stuck on the wall. Ha <laughs> ha! You can't get me. Ooh, danger lava. This is probably not good. All right, let's take our time through here, guys, so I don't get melted in the lava. What? What would you do if your school was like an obby like this? Would you be like, wee, this is fun? Or would be like, oh my gosh, this is crazy. All right, what are we doing now, Daisy? We're getting, um, we're jumping on these oasis. They're very bouncy. <laughs> okay, that was fun. But I fell, so, um, but at least there's a net so you don't fall in the lava. It's like being in the circus. Wee, ah, oh my gosh, I don't want to fall down there. Yes. All right, checkpoint. OMG, come on, this is taking forever. Oh my gosh, I've jumped on this like six times. Oh my gosh, I gotta hurry. Oh boy. Every single time I die, it's like, would you like to buy a gravity coil? No, um, no. Would you like to buy something that would make you less of a noob? Oh, I'm gonna make it this time, Daisy. Yay! <laughs> Congratulations! I'm should not quite sure why I have you on my channel though, Molly. What? Because I'm your amazing sister. Why else would I be on your channel? I know, but you die a lot in the abbeys. Okay, yeah, but it doesn't mean that I'm not cool or something. True, you are pretty cool, even if you drive me crazy a lot. Well, that's my job. I'm your sister, Daisy. I'm supposed to drive you crazy! I wouldn't be doing a good job if I wasn't. Uh, do you think it's gonna be like this when we're all grown up too, Molly? Probably. Mom's sister Dora drives her crazy. Okay, Daisy, what's this about? Ew! 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 There's a giant booger coming out of his nose. Scarred for life? Gross. <laughs> that was so disgusting. Yeah, yuck. Why do they have to put that in the game? Blech. Um, yeah, just so you know, these lockers cannot hold any kind of weight and will fall in the lava. So hurry, hurry, and also do some more hurrying. Okay, so far I'm doing pretty good on this book part. Whoa, Daisy, don't be pushing me now. <laughs> There's no save point there? Are you serious? There should be a save point. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Daisy, what are you doing? I'm getting afraid of the lava. Okay, you could be afraid of the lava. I'm totally getting ahead of you now, though. Ooh. Oh, except for I just died. And now Daisy is ahead of me. Uh, Daisy, I don't, I don't know what to do here because... Oh, wait, there we go. It was like a big gap, and it was because they hadn't reset yet. The lockers sink and then come back when you step on them, and somebody else had stepped on them, and they hadn't come back yet. Molly, don't look now, but there's giant colored pencils that are going to try to smoosh you. <sighs> like I said, I knew homework was a bad idea. <laughs> Holy guacamole, Molly. Look, those are some pretty sharp pencils. They must have spent all day sharpening those in the school sharpening. Um, the school pencil sharpener, I mean. <laughs> waiting, waiting, waiting. Oh my gosh, cutie. That is so true. You are super adorable. Love your outfit, your hair. Everything looks adorable. Um, I just got killed. That was not fun. Guess what I'm gonna do? Oh my gosh, guys. I only got five Robux left. This was worth it, though, because this part was hard. Um, Daisy, are you serious? You were already there and you didn't even skip? Yeah, it wasn't that hard, Molly. Uh, says the girl who died, like, five times in a row. Okay, yeah, it was a little hard. Saving, saving, saving. What's this? It's a, it's a giant button, Molly, but I don't know what it does. I don't know what it does either. Oh, I think it goes to this exit button over here. See? Wait, is this the right way or is this the wrong way? Ooh. Uh, I'm not really sure, Molly, but I think this might be the right way. Boing, 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 wee! Oh, yeah, this is the right way. Um, Sometimes games 
have parts in them where they all look the same and you're like, okay, is this the same part I was just in or a new part? I don't know, I'm so confused. Okay, it says the exit is this way. I'm gonna catch you, stick around. What, no, I don't wanna stick around, you're crazy town. Whoa, he's after me guys, he is definitely after me. Um, all right, I've gotta find all of these buttons and press them, I guess. Oh God, no, 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 oh no, oh no, oh no. Um, guys, he's just standing there. All pimply faced and creepy looking. And oh God, he's gonna get me right now. Whoa! Press all the buttons. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, he's right behind me. I've got one more button to press. I don't know how I'm gonna press it. This is kind of depressing. <laughs> get it? Oh my God, it took me into the bathroom and I got a shiny dollar as well. Um, now we're going down into the sewers. Better than being up there, Molly. Better than being up there. Uh, did you hit the checkpoint? I don't think you did, Daisy. Oh, speed run! Whoa, 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 whoa. Holy guacamole. This is much better than I thought it would be. Even though it's a speed run, it's making me feel kind of crazy. Boing, 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 boing. Ah! Oh my gosh, no! Oh, whew, that was creepy. I almost died right there. It was totally freaking me out. Um, then boing, 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 O-M-G, 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 I didn't die once, so proud of myself, that was epically hard, have you guys played this yet? Uh, this game is so fun if you haven't played it yet. And, oh my gosh, I just got more, um, I just got more lunch money back, yes. Uh-oh, guys, this is what he was talking about, fighting at recess. Oh, no! Let me tell you a, my story, kid. I don't want to hear your story. I was once a loser like you until a bully approached me. I tried to explain to him that I had no money, but he didn't care. He kicked me into the sand. And while I sat there crying, all he did was laugh. I decided I would never be bullied again. I trained to become strong so I could get my revenge. Are you taking it out on me? I wasn't mean. No longer would people pick on me. <laughs> then I became strong. At that moment, I knew I was meant to be the alpha bully. Uh, I think it's a bad idea. And now I have to beat you up. Um, okay. Um, well, I'm just thinking I'm gonna run and shoot you with these lasers. Actually, I think they're tennis balls, <laughs> which is kind of funny, actually. You're throwing basketballs at me, but just standing there. That's not gonna work out so good for you. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. oh man, I hit him right in the braces on that one. All right, bully. You going down, my friend. Oh. <laughs> Take that, bully. Molly! <sighs> He's still after me. It's gonna be okay, Daisy. You're gonna make it to the end, I promise. Yes, there's me dancing. Here's me getting three badges. I only found $5 of the lunch money though, guys. Did you find all of it? Let me know in the comment section below. And we! <laughs> Molly, we did it! We we won against the bully. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching today. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Gaming with Daisy, for more fun videos like this one. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys! day 9 45 and i didn't have to get up for school i wish summer could last forever don't you daisy of course daisy's already out of bed she seriously treats summer vacation like it's school time she wakes up at like seven o'clock in the morning she's crazy i like to sleep in on my summer vacation uh, uh, and then i like to eat lots and lots of waffles hey molly good morning hey hey mom good morning Hey, Molly. Hmm, let's see. What else do I need to do before tonight? Before tonight? Why? What's tonight? Oh, nothing. <laughs> what would you like for breakfast, Molly? I'm thinking everything. I'm starving. It's like between breakfast and lunch. So I need to eat everything for breakfast and lunch. Well, actually, the thing between breakfast and lunch is called brunch. Brunch? Ooh, I like this. You mean I can eat breakfast? Then eat brunch, then eat lunch? Um, well, I think you're supposed to have brunch and not eat those two things. Nah, let's eat all three. Sounds good to me. Mm. Mom, this waffle's delicious. I'm glad you like it. Mom, why are you so distracted today? What are you doing? 
Oh, nothing. <laughs> Just doing some last minute things. Okay. Mm, that was delicious. Now it's time to play some Roblox. Daisy, what's the password? It's you can't play Roblox because um it's my turn. That is not the password and it's not your turn. I am actually going to play Roblox right now. Whether you like it or not. Uh, no, Molly. No Roblox right now. No Roblox right now? Are you crazy, Mom? It's time for Roblox. It's summer vacation. No, you're not going to play any Roblox today at all. Say what? Mom, do you even know what you're saying? You're going to ruin my summer vacation. I need to play Roblox. No, Molly. Did you ever stop to think that there might be something more fun to do today? More fun than Roblox? <laughs> Yeah, right, Mom. There's nothing more fun than Roblox. Well, maybe not more fun, but equally as fun and amazing to do. Mom, what exactly are you talking about? Okay, I guess it's time to tell you girls. Come on into the living room. What? What is it? I mean, really, Mom, could anything be more special and important and a good memory than playing Roblox? Well, that depends. Um... How much do you girls like doing amazing things? I like doing amazing things, don't you, Molly? Yeah, I guess. Molly, you should turn that frown upside down because I have two tickets for two very special girls to see Taylor Swift's Eras Tour tonight. What? What did you just say? Huh? Say that again? I have two tickets here that I purchased for two very special girls that I know for the Taylor Swift Eras Tour tonight. Who are the girls? Who are they? they they're so lucky. <laughs> Molly, I think she means us. You do mean us, right, Mom? Right? We're the two special girls, right? Of course you're the two special girls. Holy guacamole! We're going to see Taylor Swift! And you girls got amazing seats. Now I suggest you girls go find amazing outfits to wear. Holy moly! Daisy, we're going to see Taylor Swift! Oh, this is going to be amazing! It's going to be amazing! I can't even s stand still. Oh my gosh. I have got to do so much stuff so that I look perfect for this concert. What am I going to wear? What am I going to wear? Okay, I'll just I'll just look at my dresser. I'm sure, I'm sure there's something good in here. How about this, Daisy? You should see me in a crown. Mommy, that's Billie Eilish! Oh my god, did you just get Billie Eilish and Taylor Swift confused? <gasps> oh my gosh! I can't even be a Taylor Swift fan right now! Molly, you're just freaking out. It's okay. But seriously, lose the crown. You look amazing. Were you going to a ball or what? I just want to look amazing for this show. And you cannot go dress like that, Molly. I know, I know. I'll find something good. Molly, quit clowning around. Pick out your outfit immediately. Um, okay, but you don't like this one? Molly, are you serious right now? How's this? Ta-da! Really, Molly? That's what you choose? Uh, you and I have totally different fashion senses. <laughs> Look at it says, no, not today. <laughs> that means I'm not going to take a nap because I'm going to be at the Taylor Swift Eras Tour. Good thing we're not going to see you in concert. Everybody would boo and throw tomatoes. <laughs> okay, that was kind of funny. All right, I'm ready to go. All right, Molly. Um, I can't believe this. This is going to be amazing. Wait a minute, Daisy. It's only noon. The concert doesn't even start till like 7 or 8 o'clock. What are we going to do until then? Girls, come on. We're going to go to the salon and have a special girls' day. Oh, my gosh. We're getting our hair done and our nails and stuff. Your hair already looks perfect, Daisy. It could look more perfect, Molly. It really could. What do you girls think? How about a limo to go see Taylor Swift? Am I dreaming right now? I think I might be dreaming. Someone just pinch me and, like, like seriously, I'll pinch you, Molly. <laughs> Ow, Daisy, don't really pinch me. See, you're not dreaming. Come on, girls, get in the limo. It's time to go to the salon. OMG, this is going to be the best day of my entire life. I hope so, girls. You worked so hard this last school year. I think you deserve a special day. Well, except for Molly, she got a lot of detentions. Yeah, but I did better towards the end. Yes, Molly, A for effort. Wow, this is super loud. I know, Molly. <laughs> the hair dryer usually is. Are you going to do something special with your hair for the concert? I'm thinking about it. Oh, Molly, are you going to change your hair color? Yeah. How about this? 
Holy guacamole! I don't know, I'm still deciding. Wow, that's so cool, Molly. Really, you think so, Mom? I sure do. You look like a rock star. Daisy, look at me. What? You got your hair colored pinky purple colored? That's pretty cool. Thanks, Daisy. You look exactly the same. No, my hair is more shiny than it was before. Okay, girls. It's time to head out to the Taylor Swift concert. I'm so excited. Let's go get in the limo. Mom, can we stop at McDonald's? I'm really hungry. Of course we can, Molly. I'm going to stick my head out the top. I need to dry my hair before we get there. <laughs> All right, Molly, well, be careful um, and hold on tight, okay? Okay, Mom, we're ready when you want. Mom, you have to drive the limo. Oh, that's right. <laughs> I didn't hire a driver. No one was available. Everyone was going to the Taylor Swift concert. Yeah, the town is like dead. That's because they're already there. Yeah, we just need to go through the drive-thru because I'm starving. And then, you know, we'll be on our way. Oh, guacamole! This is amazing! Marty, uh, maybe you shouldn't have stuck your head out the window of the limo. Why does my hair look ridiculous? It's a little crazy, but... I don't care. That was fun. Oh my gosh! There's Taylor! Taylor, it's me! I'm your biggest fan! Marty, did you buy a Taylor Swift t-shirt? I totally did. <laughs> You're the reason for the teardrops on my guitar. Oh! I'm G, an old school song. I love you, Taylor. I'm your biggest fan. Oh my gosh. Someone is posing as Taylor is up on the stage right now. It's a, it's a stunt double, Molly. That's a, whoa. I wish I could be Taylor Swift's stunt double. <laughs> that would be amazing. OMG, look at her rising up in the air. Wait, is that one of her fans? Oh my God, Molly. He must have jumped up on the, st on the stage. And now, wait, there's her stunt double. I can't keep track of everything that's going on at the Eras tour right now. Well, how many Taylors are there? Taylor clones. She's about to sing one of her greatest hits. I'm so excited right now. Hey, it's me. I'm the problem, it's me. OMG, I love this song. Me too, Molly. At tea time, everybody agrees. <laughs> awesome singing, Daisy. Molly, I feel like the luckiest two girls in the world right now that we got to come to this concert. Me too, Daisy. Wait, did you change your outfit? Yeah, I kind of jump up and down a lot in that one. So I decided to just kick it totally cool tonight look at this arena look at all those people yeah we got to stand right up front because we're youtubers it's pretty awesome yeah <laughs> i'm never gonna forget this life this this night for the entire rest of my life hey fans what's up it's so nice to see you all welcome to pittsburgh all right ice spice are you ready to do our awesome song yeah, Taylor, totally. Whoa, which one's actually Taylor? They all are, Molly. Remember, they're the clones. OMG, this is going to be amazing. I've never seen Taylor or her clone or Ice Spice. We love you. We love you so much. <laughs> the Star Squad loves you, Taylor. <laughs> We're so happy to be here. Molly, I am screaming so loud. I can't hear anything. Me and the Daisy and I'm jumping up and down so much. It's amazing. This concert is so cool. Right now, I just want to give a shout out to Molly and Daisy from the Star Squad. Everybody, let's hear it for my favorite YouTubers. Daisy, did she just say that what I think she just said? I, I think we might be dreaming, Molly. I think this might all be a dream. If it's a dream, I never want to wake up. I can't believe it, King Dan. We're going to be parents in a few short hours. I know. I'm so excited. I'm finally going to have my son. Or daughter. How do you know it's not going to be a princess? I'll be happy if it's a boy or a girl, as long as they're happy and healthy. Me too. I always thought I was going to have a princess, but maybe I'll have a prince. Maybe. Who knows? <laughs> Until the moment arrives. Have you been working on the nursery? Absolutely, follow me and I'll show you. Wow, this room sure is fit for a princess. Or a prince. I mean, I'll have to paint the walls and stuff if it's a prince. You're really sure that it's going to be a princess, aren't you? 
Yeah, I really am. Whoa! Three beds? What do we need three beds for? Don't tell me we're having triplets. Oh! So many diapers, so many bottles, so many babies! <laughs> oh, King Dan, calm down. We are not having triplets. Well, as far as I know, anyway. As far as you know? So you mean there's a possibility? <laughs> there's always a possibility, but so far, I'm only having one that I know of. This is just to try out three different beds to see which one is the most comfy for our baby. Oh, phew. I thought we were going to have three royal babies and three royal dirty diapers and three nighttime feedings and three... It's okay, Dan. Take a deep breath. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm just so excited. I was just a little worried about three babies. It's okay. Uh, well, I'm kind of tired. I think I'm going to rest now. And I have to get to work. <laughs> I'll see you later, honey. Bye. I can't believe I'm going to be a mom. Hey, sister. Oh, hey, Dora. Whoa. What, what, what are you wearing? Your your hair looks so different. And, and your skin is green. And, and your outfit is well very different. I'm very different now. <laughs> I'm finally myself. <laughs> what do you mean you're finally yourself? Weren't you yourself before? No. I was covering my true identity as a witch. What? You're a witch? Uh, are you a good witch or a bad witch? <laughs> I'm a bad witch. Um, I can sort of tell by the evil laugh. Dora, why? Mom and Dad would not approve of this. I don't care. It's how I am. <laughs> it's how I was born. Well, actually, I was cursed. But anyway, I'm a witch now. And a witch I shall ever be. Dora, you don't have to do this. Turn back now. Sorry. <laughs> and I think for my first curse, I shall curse your firstborn baby. What? Dora, no! Not the baby! Anyone but the baby! No! Uh, yes. The night that your baby is born, I will return. And I will curse her forever! <laughs> Dora, no! <laughs> no! <laughs> oh yeah, I'm gonna be a dad! I'm gonna be a dad! <laughs> I was supposed to go to work, but I'm just so excited. I think I'm gonna dance on the dance floor instead! Is she, is she crying? I better go find out what's wrong. Queen Laura, what, what, what's wrong? <laughs> Why are you crying? It's, it's okay. It's really not okay. Dora was here. Your sister, Dora? What, what's going on? She's a witch, Queen Dan. She's a witch. A witch? Is she a good witch or a bad one? Definitely a bad one. Definitely a bad one. Why? What'd she say? She said she's going to curse our firstborn baby on... On the day that they're born. Well, actually, on the night that they're born. But still, it's bad. It's really bad. OMG. Don't worry about a thing, Queen Laura. I will tell all of our guards at the castle to ban, to ban your sister Dora from the castle forever. And she won't even be able to get near the baby. I hope it works. I really do. Trust me, it will. Okay. Oh, no. This is bad. This is so bad. Oh, my gosh. She's here. The baby is here! And it's a... It's a... Girl! Oh, hi, little princess. You're so adorable. What happened? What's going on? Oh my gosh, is that it? Is that a... Is that a princess? Oh, she's adorable! Oh, I love her! What are we going to name her? I don't know, Dan. What should we name her? Well, I think we should name her Molly. Oh, I love that name. Hi, Princess Molly. I'm your mommy. And I'm your daddy. <laughs> I really thought you wanted a boy. I thought I did too, but now that I see my little princess, my heart is so full. Oh. But, but what, what about your sister? 
Well, didn't you tell the guards that she was banished? Yeah, I just hope that she doesn't have a magic spell that can get through it. Me too. But right now, all I can focus on is my beautiful baby. Yeah, she sure is beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna go check with the guards and make sure that that they're that they're standing on guard and that and that, that evil witch can't come back in here. Good idea, King Dan. Good idea. I'll stay here with Princess Molly. Right, Molly? I said to put that to you to Ha 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 ha! Ah! Witch Dora, how did you get in here? I'm magic. <laughs> Your guards can't stand up to me. Now let me see my niece. Not a chance! <coughs> oh, that little brat cries a lot. Hey, get out of here, Dora! Queen Laura, run! I'll take care of everything! Um, but Dad, what about you? Just run! Okay! Come on, come on, Princess! We've gotta go! Wait, I have to curse that baby! <laughs> Princess, I, I hate to do this. I, I'll miss you for my entire life, but... But there's a ship down there, and it's gonna take you to a new land where my evil witch sister can't put a curse on you. You'll be safe there, little baby. You'll be so safe. All aboard! All aboard! Oh, <laughs> Princess Molly, I'm going to miss you for the rest of my life. I did not like that my dad did you, Mama. Oh, I'll never forget your sweet little face. Go and live your life and be safe, my beautiful daughter. I'm going to miss you. I did that my dad. Wow, I can't believe it! My first day of high school! This is going to be amazing! <laughs> Excuse me. Get over here, Molly. Uh, that's my stepsister, Sarah. She really doesn't like me. You see, I was adopted. And, well... She just thinks that I'm, like, supposed to wait on her all the time. Get over here, Molly. Don't talk to any of my friends. I don't want them to think that you're actually, like, partly my sister. Um, by the way, I'm all your sister. I was adopted. Uh, yeah, you're my stepsister. Ugh, get out of here. Actually, I'm your real sister because I was adopted into the family. I call you my stepsister because I don't even want to admit that, like, you're even like a hundred percent my sister maybe i should call you like my quarter sister or like my not sister you're so rude sarah why are you so rude to me whatever so go get me some breakfast i'm hungry why because if you don't i'm gonna tell mom <sighs> you've already gotten me in enough trouble with them that's right now go make me something to eat okay fine um what do you want I don't care. Just get me anything. Actually, yes, I do care. Um, I want a, um, I want a cookie. Okay, fine. Um, breakfast isn't even being served yet. It doesn't matter. I still want it. Okay, well, I need your card. <laughs> yeah, right. Spend your allowance on it. Sarah, you're so rude. Ugh. I'm so sick of my sister right now. Or as she calls me, her stepsister, or her quarter sister, or her not a sister. Um, what should I get? I'm starving. Oh, hi there. I I'm Brookie. Oh, hey. I'm not supposed to talk to anybody. What? Why? Um, uh, are you in trouble? Do you have detention? No. It's my first day of school. I, I don't have detention. Well, why can't you talk to anybody then? My sister told me I can't. Well, I mean, Sarah told me. Oh, is Sarah your sister? Um, uh, she, 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 said, she said not to tell anybody because I'm not cool and she doesn't want anybody to know. Oh, well, everybody knows that she has a sister. You're the adopted sister, right? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm the adopted sister. Excuse me, I have to give her her cookie right now or she'll be grumpy. You know, you don't have to wait on her. She's not in charge of you. Really? You think so? Yeah, and guess what? I'd love to be your friend. You would? Yeah, now eat that cookie and show her who's boss. You want me to eat her cookie? Well, you paid for it, so really, it's yours. Yeah, true. Mm. This is really delicious. Mm. What are you doing? Why are you eating my cookie? 
Um, well, it's sort of her cookie. No one asked you, you nerd. Hey, quit being mean to my new friend. Are you standing up to me? I don't think so. Oh, you ate the last bite of that cookie. How could you? I'm gonna tell mom on you. Oh my gosh, your sister is such a brat. Tell me about it. Did you just call me a brat? That's it. <laughs> I'm going to make sure you both have detention for the rest of your lives. Yeah, right. I'm such a good student. Um, actually, she's got some sort of wand. What, what's this all about? Your sister has magic powers? Are you serious? <laughs> yes, I do. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Everybody run! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, my sister's gonna curse me with detention forever and it's my first day of school. This isn't going so good. This isn't going so good. Where are you? I told you you have to do exactly what I say. Sarah, did you trick your sister and make you think you had magic powers? Yeah, it was awesome. Wait, what? She just tricked me? You don't actually have magic powers? Of course I don't. <laughs> now... You're gonna scrub my floors of my room when we get home. You're gonna make me awesome chocolate chip cookies. You're gonna do all of my homework for the rest of time just to make it up to me how you treated me this morning. Sarah, I've gotta tell you something. I'm super sick of you. What? What did you say? I said, I'm tired of you bossing me around. Uh-oh, this isn't gonna end well. I, 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 I don't think you're my sister at all. Oh, good. I think that you're more like, mm, not my sister at all. You just are my, well, waiter. What? And my cleaner and my homework doer. <laughs> ah, this is making me so upset. Ah! What, 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 what did you do to me? I'm so ugly. Uh, actually, I just exposed what you really are. If you're ugly on the inside, then you're gonna be ugly on the outside. Whoa, Molly, you have magical powers. Yeah, and you never told me about it. And now I'm ugly. Oh my gosh, I, I don't even think that I'm a human. Yeah, you're an ugly alien. Sarah, be quiet, I'm trying to think. Come on, Molly, let's get out of here. Oh my gosh, that's a good idea. Yeah, before I tell everyone that you're magic and you're evil. Oh my gosh, I can't ever go back here again. It's gonna be okay, Molly. It really is. Brookie, I think I think it's time to find out who my real parents are. What do you mean? I mean, my my adopted family told me that I came here on a ship, and I have to find out from where. Obviously, I come from a different land where there's magic. Wow, Molly. We just became friends. I wish you could stay longer. Me too, Brookie, but when I find out where I came from, I'll be back. Okay, Molly. Well, good luck on your quest. Thank you. I'm gonna need it. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I can't believe I have magical powers. Where did they come from? I never had them before until I got really angry at my stepsister, Sarah. And now, or my half-sister, or my no-sister, whatever she calls me. She doesn't want to admit that I'm her sister. But anyway, I got really mad at her and my powers came out. Now I have to research where I came from. I have to know. Where do magical powers come from? Okay, let's see what Google has to say. There's a special land where everybody has magical powers, good and bad. But it's far from here. You have to take a special boat. Okay, that's it. I have to get on this boat. And I have to go find my mom and dad. If they're still there. I don't know what I'm going to find out. But I have to know. try to find my mom and dad wow look at this place this land is amazing there's an ice castle and and another castle there's so many castles here 
It makes me wonder if, if maybe my parents are king and queen. <laughs> yeah, right. That would never happen. <laughs> that would make me a princess. And I don't feel like a princess. Nope. I feel more like a servant, especially with my, well, my sister Sarah. Oh, it's such a beautiful day. I wonder what my beautiful princess Molly is doing. Gosh, she must be 15 years old now. I haven't seen her in so long. I wish I could see my baby again. <laughs> what are you doing, servant? Oh, oh, uh, hi, Dora. I was just taking a little bit of a break because I was so tired from doing all the chores and stuff. There are no breaks here. And you're a to address me as Queen Dora. Uh, yes, Queen Dora. Uh, very, 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 very true. You are the queen now. So, uh, yes, Queen Dora. Have you been thinking about Princess Molly again? Ha, I wish I could have gotten my hands on her. But you sent her far away where I could never find her before I could curse her. Um, no, I wasn't thinking about her. I don't know who's that. I don't even know who that is. Oh, yeah, right. You will scrub all of the palace's toilets for this one. Okay, Queen Dora. I, I will do it. I'll go now. Hurry up, too. My dinner needs to be done by five o'clock. Okay. Wow, look at this place. It's the most beautiful castle I've ever seen. La, 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 la. I can't believe I'm finally here. Whoa, a tea party with some cake. I'm starving. Those pirates on the ship didn't have very good food. Mmm, cupcakes and mm, juice and tea. Oh, look at those cookies. Those look delicious. Ha, 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 Who is this? A visitor to our island? Ha, 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 ha. Hello there. Who might you be? Oh, hi. I'm Molly. Who are you? I'm Dora, the queen of this faraway land. Molly, you say, huh? <laughs> what are you doing here? Oh, I'm looking for my parents. You see, I found out that I had magic, and um, they said this is where magic comes from. Oh, really? <laughs> I think I know exactly who your parents are. Follow me. <laughs> Wow, she laughs a lot. Must be they're really happy here. Dan, you shouldn't be wearing your crown. You know how up that upsets Queen Dora. I'll never call her Queen Dora. She's not my queen. She's an evil witch. And you and I are king and queen forever. I know, Dan. We have to figure out how to how to get her out of this place. But, but right now, we just need to go back to scrubbing toilets. We're really going to be in trouble. Oh, I don't want to. I know, but it's what we need to do right now, and we can take comfort in the fact that Princess Molly is safe in a faraway land. Okay. <laughs> Here's what you were looking for. Um, okay. It's two people about to scrub toilets. What's this all about? This is your parents, I think. <laughs> what? They're servants here? Well, I don't care. If they're my parents, I'm going to love them. <laughs> Go say hello. Hi. Um, I, 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 I think I know you. Um, I'm not sure that I know you. Who, who are you? Yeah. Where did you come from? I've never seen you here before. Um, my name is my name is Molly. What? What did you say? I think she said her name was 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 Molly. Yeah, it is Molly. C could it be? Could it be our princess? Princess? What are you guys talking about? You scrub toilets. Wait a minute. Are you wearing a crown on your head? I told you you should have taken that crown off. Um, yes, I am, because I was once the mighty King Dan. And I was once the beautiful Queen Laura, and we had a beautiful baby. Her name was Princess Molly. What? Are you serious? That's right. And, well... An evil witch took over our, our land, and so I put her on a giant ship and sent her to Earth so that she could be safe. Oh my gosh! You guys are my, you're my parents! Like my real parents! And, and, and I never knew what happened until I got really mad at my, my, well, she's not really my sister, but she doesn't want me to be her sister. But anyway, I was adopted by her family, and she just hates me, and she was being mean to me again, and so I used my magic powers, and whammo! I found out that I really belonged here to you guys! Wait a minute, you were born with magic powers? 
Are you a good witch or a bad witch? Yes. Are you a good witch or a bad witch? Well, I, I, don't, I, 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 don't, I don't really know. I, I, I just started using my powers. I, I... <laughs> She's going to be a bad witch, of course. <laughs> what? No, no, I'm not. A bad witch? No. Not my only daughter. No, this can't be. Oh, my heart is broken. No. No, this can't be. Tell us it's not true. It's not true. I'm not a bad witch. I'm I'm no witch. I'm just I have magic powers and I'm Molly. I'm not a, I'm not a witch. You must choose. <laughs> good witch or bad witch? <laughs> well, then I choose to be a good witch. Wrong answer, Princess Molly. I'm a princess. Holy guacamole! I'm a princess. <laughs> not for long. Pretty soon you're going to be a hideous Evil bad witch just like your auntie. Who's my aunt? You're looking at her. Oh, you're my aunt? You're really ugly. She wasn't always that way. She just turned that way when her heart turned to stone. <laughs> I like that my heart was turned to stone. <laughs> never! You'll never make me a bad witch! And 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 this kingdom belongs to my parents! You evil witch! <laughs> we'll see about that. <laughs> Take that! <laughs> Molly, no! Are you okay? I'm okay! I put up a force field around myself! And now it's time for you to become, I don't know, good or something. I don't think that's possible, Molly. Just try to... Just try to banish her from the, the kingdom forever! <laughs> Your magic is no match for mine. We'll see about that! I've got good on my side, and good always wins. Evil always wins. Good! Evil. <laughs> good! What's happening to me? What's happening? I feel... I feel weird! I feel like I'm disappearing! Where did she go? What, what, what happened? I don't know. I think she's gone. Princess Molly, you've banished the evil witch from our kingdom. And you guys are king and queen again. Oh, my daughter. I knew you were going to be special and wonderful, but I never imagined you'd be this amazing. Oh, I'm so happy to see you. I'm happy to see you too, Mom. And you too, Dad. Oh, my little princess. And now we can live happily ever after. Yeah, I just, I'm just gonna miss my friend that I made in Human World. Well, now that you're magic, you can bring her here anytime. That's right. You just have to say her name and she'll be instantly teleported to you. OMG, this place is amazing! And I love you guys. I can't believe I finally get to be with my mom and dad. Well, believe it, cause here you are. <laughs> yeah. And everybody say, hey, Princess Molly, because that's what I am. Hey, Princess Molly. Hey, Princess Molly. <laughs>welcome to starbrook's coffee what can it get for you today Ugh, it's that girl i go to school with mom she's like really chipper it's annoying um excuse me we just don't want you to be so happy first thing in the morning like we haven't even had our coffee yet oh sorry um that's just part of the starbrook's way everyone is happy yeah but we're the customers so we're always right and we're saying you're annoying oh Okay, um, I'm sorry for being annoying. What what can I get for you? Didn't we just tell you? Okay, one coffee for you and another coffee for Sarah. <laughs> um, yeah, if you want to leave me a tip, there is a chip, tip jar over there. How rude. Did she just ask for a tip? No, I didn't ask for one. I just said there's a tip jar. Seriously, why would we give you a tip? You're doing your job. Oh, well, it's customary to give a barista a tip. Whatever. Do I look like I'm ordinary or want to give you a tip? I don't do what everyone else does. Yeah, I didn't raise my daughter to be ordinary. Besides, you already get paid enough, don't you? Well, I'm not driving a Ferrari like you guys are. <laughs> and I probably won't off tips, but you know, it's an honest living and I'm glad to have a job. Whatever. I wasn't even listening. Blah, blah, blah. Come on, Sarah. Let's go. Yeah, Mom, I'm already on my way out. 
Have a nice day! <sighs> Sometimes this job is so hard. Oh, look, my Amazon Prime is here. Can't wait to get all this new makeup. <coughs> what? Why does it sound like a box is crying? Well, Mom, maybe you just spend so much on your credit card, it's your credit card crying. Whatever, Sarah. This was a perfect purchase. This makeup is amazing. <coughs> Mom, I don't think that's your makeup from Amazon. You better check it out. <sighs> Fine. What's this? A kid? I didn't order this. Yeah, Mom, I would definitely give that seller on Amazon a one star. You ordered makeup and you got a baby? How annoying. She's not even, like, cute. Look at her. And she talks a lot. Do you think Amazon would take a return on this? Probably not. What are we going to do with it? Well, I guess we could keep it, Sarah, and, like... We need a housekeeper and stuff, and we need a cook, so this this baby could grow up and do that. Well, Mom, that's not a bad idea. Fine. We'll keep it then. Mommy! 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 Who are you calling Mommy? I'm not your Mommy. Oh, but you adopted me, didn't you? Uh, yeah, I guess, sort of. What do you want? You're being annoying, and I'm trying to watch my TV show. Yeah, Mom, tell her to go away. Um, I'm sorry, um, I was just wondering, there's a playgroup at the park, could, could I go? Absolutely not. Now go make me a snack, I'm hungry. But, but, Mommy, I... I told you, I'm not your mom. Okay, um, I was just wondering, um, Karen, can, can, can... No, you can't have any treats either, now go make me a snack. Make me one too. Okay. Oh, I just feel like I never get to go do anything. I'm always just making their snacks and, and I never get any break. <laughs> okay, I guess I'll get them each a piece of pizza. They'll probably like that. My own stomach is growling and I probably can't even eat anything because they're mean. What did you say? Did you just call me mean? Um, no, I, I didn't call you mean. I, I, I mean, okay, I, I sort of did. Don't you lie to me, child. You know what? Since you're a liar, go stand in the corner. Yeah, <laughs> go stand in the corner. Fine. <laughs> I wish I didn't have to live here anymore. <laughs> don't cry. It's super annoying. We can't hear it over the TV. Yeah, you don't have to be in timeout, but just like vacuum the floor and stuff. You know, I'm not your maid. Actually, yes, you are. We give you a roof over your head and we give you food in your stomach and clothes on your back. So basically, you have to do whatever we say. I mean, we could have just left you in the Amazon box or we could have returned you. Okay, fine. I'll do the chores. I don't like my life. I want a real family. <laughs> real family it's like i don't even belong here how did i just show up in a box that doesn't even make sense <laughs> less crying more vacuuming mom i can't even take her i'm going upstairs right now okay honey sure go right ahead well are you gonna get the door or not um yeah i can get the door sure Hi there, um, you can come in if you want. Oh, why, uh, thank you! And who might you be? My name's Annabelle. Well, hello, Annabelle. I'm here because I am on a mission from the Queen and King. Really? About what? You said the Queen and King? What's this all about? You know, my daughter, who, not this one, she's not my real daughter. Oh, she isn't? Where did she come from? Who cares about her? My other daughter is definite princess material. Is your prince dating at this point? Uh, yes he is, but he's not looking for any new princesses or anything like that. He has a girlfriend he likes very much. Well, my daughter is definitely the best princess of them all. So why are you here? 
Yeah, I'm a, I'd be like the best, best princess. Wait, so I'm confused. Are you a princess already? Well, yeah, in my mom's mind I am. But yeah, are you an actual official princess? This is confusing. No, she's not, but we're just saying she'd make an amazing princess so the prince could marry her. Um, okay, you're confusing me right now, and I'm not here for this. I'm here because the king and queen are looking for their little girl. Wait, what? They had a daughter too? Yes, and an evil witch cursed her so she didn't remember anything and took her far away. Whoa, I wonder who we could be talking about. Oh, I wish I was the lost princess. These two aren't a very nice family. Well, we don't know who you're talking about. Um, actually, this little girl looks a lot like the king and queen. I'd like to question her. Whatever. She's just our maid. Oh, uh, how did you get here, little girl? Um, she told me that I showed up in a box on the doorstep. Oh, and you didn't call the authorities? Well, no. I thought... Um, when she grew up a little, she could do the chores, and I would give her a place to live. It's been miserable! I don't like it at all! Oh, I'm sorry, little girl, but I can't take you with me unless you actually belong to the king and queen. Oh, okay, well, I'm sure I'm not a princess. Well, we'll see about that. Our scientists at the castle have just come up with this. What is that? It is a royalty detector. If this little girl has any royalty in her, it will detect it right away. I'm sure I'm not a princess. There's nothing special about me. That's right. You're not special at all. Actually, the, the royal detector is going crazy. I think this might be the lost princess. What? Me? The lost princess? Your parents have been missing you terribly. Oh, we had to make sure that the Wicked Witch was actually gone from Brookhaven before we could search for you. That's what took so long. We didn't want to curse you and turn you into a frog or something like that. Ugh, oh, whatever. She's not a princess. She's nothing more than a servant. Actually, it seems that I am a princess. Goodbye, evil number one and grumpy number two. You're both a bunch of evil Karens. I'm going with this nice man. That's right. The king and queen will be so happy to see you. Come on, Annabelle. Goodbye and good riddance. Whoa, a limo. I'm definitely going to go to the castle in style. Only the best for our little princess. Yeah, I could get used to this. What kind of music do you like? Oh, my mom! Actually, she's not my mom. She never lets me pick the music. Well, I will. I present to you your daughter, Annabelle. Annabelle? Annabelle? Is that you? Oh my gosh, she she looks just like us. Mom? Dad? Annabelle! Oh my gosh, I'm so happy to see you. Your dad and I have missed you so much. An evil witch took you away from us, but never again. That's right, dear. We're a happy family now. Oh, I had the most horrible people take me in. Ugh, they made me do chores and they never let me have snacks or go to play groups. Well, you tell us who they are and we'll make them work in the laundry room at the castle. Yeah, dear. Oh, I don't think so. I don't want them around anymore. I'm just glad I have you guys. And we're glad we have you. Aw, a family. A real family. This is the life, just chilling out. Oh, it's been such a long day. Marty! Oh, there you are, Marty. Hey, do you want to go down to the Bookhaven ice cream shop with me? What? The ice cream shop? Of course I do. That sounds delicious. I'm going to get... Mm, uh, uh, 
Knock knock, is anyone home? Oh my gosh, this day just keeps getting better. My best friend's here. Hey, Brookie. Hey guys, what's up? I just came over to see if you wanted to hang out. Totally, let's hang out. At the ice cream shop, of course. Yeah, we were just about to leave for some ice cream. Oh, um, yeah, could we just hang out here? What, why? Brookie, why are you so sad? Ugh, I can't go for ice cream. Why not? Ice cream's delicious. Are you lactose intolerant? Yeah, sometimes uh, eating dairy makes me... <laughs> Molly, rude! <laughs> sometimes cupcakes does it to me, too. And occasionally when I eat beans. Oh, Molly, that's stinky. Oh, Brookie, maybe we should go without Molly. Actually, you two go. Um, I'll just... I'll wait here till you get back. Brookie, what is going on? Why don't you want to get ice cream with us? Yeah, Brookie, why? Um... Okay, I I can't afford to go. I don't have any money. Oh, well, why didn't you say so? We'll buy your ice cream. You will? Really? You guys don't have to do that. I don't want you to spend your money on me. No, it's fine. We want you to come along. And we want you to have a delicious ice cream cone, too. So, come on, let's all go together. Okay, if, if you really don't mind. Wow, Brookie, <laughs> you beat me here. <laughs> you must be pretty excited about the ice cream. I haven't gotten ice cream all summer. I'm poor. I don't have any money. But I love ice cream. Well, get two scoops on me then. Mm, I'm having my favorite mint chocolate chip. What are you going to have, Brookie? Where's Daisy? She's so slow. I'm coming. I'm coming. Brookie, I have the slowest sister on the planet. Well, she did say that she was just a little tired today. Nothing some ice cream won't fix, right, Brookie? What kind did you get? Um, I got this blue kind. I'm not sure what kind it is yet, though. Um, that's bubblegum, Brookie. Ooh, bubblegum. That's super crazy. I got birthday cake. <sighs> yeah, it took me a long time to get healed. I noticed. Mm. Two scoops of ice cream. You guys are the nicest for buying me ice cream. I don't know what I'd do without my best friends. Probably be at home without any ice cream. <laughs> but lucky for you, we have... Lots of money. Well, we don't have a lot a lot of money, but we have enough to buy you ice cream. I have no money. So sick of being poor. Well, money isn't everything. Yeah, Blucky. Sure feels like it when you don't have any. Can't do anything fun. Can't go on school trips. Can't get ice cream. It's just plain, well, awful. Well, today you can have ice cream with us. Mmm, and it's good. Uh, are you guys ready? I, I, I think I should be heading home now. Sure, we could go if you want to. Let's go. Come on, Brookie. I'll race you home. <laughs> Last one to the street is a rotten egg. Brookie, are you coming? Are you oh, you're so slow. Come on, Brookie. Molly, don't be mean to Brookie. Yeah, Molly, don't be mean to me. Besides, you're the one that I'm leaving in the dust. Only because I turned around to see where you were. Molly, I am so sick of being poor. Well... I'm sorry, Brookie, but it sounds like maybe it's just the way it is for you. Maybe. Ugh, I just want to have a nice house like this one. Whoa. It looks like you have a pretty good imagination because this house is like a million dollars. I know, but I just really love it. Maybe someday when you're a grown-up you can have this house. Yeah, maybe. Well, I'll see you tomorrow, Molly. Bye! Molly, what are you doing right now? It's almost time for class. Um, believe it or not, I'm actually studying. What? No, you're not. You're probably on YouTube. No, for reals. I'm actually studying for the math test. Holy guacamole! Feel the earth move! Molly is actually studying! Who's that? Holy guacamole! That's the coolest car I've ever seen! What car, Molly? I don't see a car. That's because you're turned around backwards, Daisy. <laughs> You have to be looking outside. Whatever, Marty. I was concentrating on, on the, on the wall. Okay, Daisy, you might not be awake yet. Do you need some coffee? I kind of do, Marty. I kind of do. Holy guacamole, Brookie! What, what are you? Are you? Are you wearing Louis Vuitton? Yeah. <laughs> sure. Of course I am. Whoa! And is that your car? Yeah, <laughs> it's brand new. Do you guys like it? Uh, yeah! Holy guacamole! It even says her name on the front of it. Oh, wow. I love your new car. 
Thanks. Well, we better get to math class. We don't want to be late or we'll fail our test. But I have so many quit. Okay. I guess I'll have to ask her the questions later. You can't ask questions during the math test, Molly. Well, it wasn't about the math test. It was about how did she afford all that? Molly, that's rude. Don't ask people about their money. Where's the teacher? Ha ha ha! There's no teacher. No math test. Mmm, this Coca-Cola is really good. Molly, where's your lunch? Well, I sort of spent all of our money at the ice cream shop yesterday. Oopsie. Oh, <laughs> hey guys, no worries. I can totally buy you lunch. Wait, what? You couldn't even afford an ice cream cone yesterday. Now you have a new car and new clothes and you have money for buying our school lunch? What is going on right now? Um, yeah, I'm cool. Look at all this cash. Now, what do you guys want? Um, I'd like some pizza, please. And a drink and some Doritos. Mighty cheap was you eating everything. Uh, yeah, that's sort of a plan. Mmm, that's pizza good. Cheapest creepers, thanks, Bookie. That was really nice of you. Don't mention it, guys. Mm, what am I going to have for lunch? Mm, I think maybe I'm going to have pizza, too. Yeah, it's definitely a good choice. Pizza's good today. Mm. Sometimes school lunch tastes like it came straight out of a dumpster. But not today. I can tell they ordered this from a local pizza shop. Mm, it was really good, Molly. Are you going to ever stop eating? No! Never! <laughs> Um, well, guys, I have to get going. Um, since it's half day at school today, I have things I have to do. Oh, well, um, okay. Bye! Molly, do you think it's weird that she has all this money all of a sudden? I think it's really weird. I think I should follow her. Follow her for what? Because I want to see where she's getting all this money from. Did she find a special tree out in the forest that, that, that grows money leaves? Because if so, I want to go there and pick all of the leaves off of it. Oh, boy, Molly, that sounds very greedy. Well, I I, I want to discover a money tree, too. Well, I'm not following her. I have an after-school job now. You do? Yep, and I love it. So have fun and let me know what's up. There's Brookie's car. <laughs> I'll see what she's up to. Where's she going? Looks like she's headed to that house she likes so much. Don't tell me she bought it. <laughs> that house was a million dollars. How would she ever afford it? I wish I had a fancy car. These are huge hills! Huge! Wait, where'd she go? There she is. Okay, I don't want to get seen. Where's this money tree she has? Hmm, this house looks like the perfect house to rob! <laughs> what? Did she say rob? Nah, <laughs> she couldn't have. Watch what she does next. <gasps> She's putting on a black outfit. Why is she doing that? <laughs> no one's home, so this should be a perfectly easy job. She is going into that house. <gasps> I hope she doesn't really say that she's robbing the place. Oh, my God. Okay, I'm going to look in the windows. <gasps> okay, I don't want to be seen. Where's she going? She's stealing stuff out of the dresser. Oh, my God. God! They have an indoor pool? That's amazing. Okay, focus, Molly! Focus! Oh, look! It's the safe! <laughs> now I'll be able to afford this kind of house because I'll steal all the money. What? Brookie's a crook? A thief? A criminal? My best friend! And I didn't even know it! Oh my god, what should I do? What should I do? What should I do? What should I do? If I call the police, my best friend will go to jail! How will I live without her? But if I don't call the police, well, then it's wrong because she's doing something criminal and, 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 and I'm supposed to call the police. Oh, God, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? Oh, no. I have to call the police on my friend. Oh, no. 911, what's your emergency? Um, I'm at 175 Brookhaven Lane and my best friend is a criminal. Could you be a little bit more specific? I kind of have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. What are you doing right now? Oh, sorry. I'm eating a donut. <laughs> I'm almost finished. <sighs> OMG! This is serious! My best friend's a criminal! She's robbing this house as we speak! What? She's robbing a house? Okay, I'll send an officer over right away. Because I can't come. I'm eating a donut. Yeah, yeah, okay. I I'll be here. Just hurry. Where are these police? I mean, they're being so slow. Holy guacamole. Wait, here they come. 
OMG! They're gonna block off Brookie's car! Brilliant police move! Okay! Who's who's gonna be a new arrest? Daisy? What are you wearing? Oh, I didn't realize she would place the car, Marty. What's going on? Daisy, why are you in a police uniform? Because this is my after school job, duh. A police officer? Yeah, I love it too. Oh, I feel so amazing. Powerful! Go power! Oh my gosh, Daisy. You as a police officer is just scary. Why? I'm good at it. I don't know. It's just something about the little pigtail. You're just too cute! You can't you can't act mean. I'm gonna act mean right now and throw you in jail if you don't talk nicer to me. Okay, fine. Um, I don't know how to be nice to you. You're my sister. Wait, I think Brookie's coming! Shh! What's going on? <gasps> OMG! What, what's going on here? What's going on is you're busted! Molly, did you did you call the cops on me? Um, I, I'm sorry, Brookie, but 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 I had to. It was the right thing to do! You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be used against you in a court of law. But she was my best friend. Yeah, and, and I had to. Who are you here to see? Uh, the only person in the jail. Who is it that you want to see? Mm. These blueberry donuts are so good. Dunkin' Donuts makes the best donuts in the world. I I'm here to see my best friend, Brookie. Oh, yeah, the criminal. Okay, you're checked in. You can go in and see her. You have a face at all? Thanks. Oh, it's you. Um, Brookie, I, I just came to see you. I I I'm sorry that our friendship has ended up this way. You should be. You called the police on me. I, I had to, Brookie. What you were doing was wrong. What I was doing was right. I'm tired of being poor. I couldn't even afford an ice cream with my friends. So I decided to take matters into my own hands. And you ruined everything. Brookie, uh, it, it, you can't just be a criminal because you're poor. That's not okay. Stop yelling at me. Well, actually, I can yell at you because I'm out here and I'm not a criminal and you're in there. So you kind of have to hear what I have to say. No, 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 no. I'm not listening. Oh, wow. That's really immature. I'm not listening. No, 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 no. Go away. We're not best friends anymore. You're not my friend at all. What? Rookie? S -s Seriously? Yeah. I don't like you. I hate you. You're horrible. You're, you're the worst person ever. Oh, my God. Brookie. Brookie. Ah, I was my best friend. Ah. Well, you do the crime, you do the time. Molly? Mo Molly, are you, are you okay up there? What? what? What's going on? Huh? Oh, oh my gosh! It was all a nightmare! Hey, Molly. <laughs> you sleepyhead. Why are you sleeping so late? I had a really rough night's sleep. It looks like it. Have you been crying? Oh, yeah. No, no, no. Never mind about that. I'm okay. Uh, I'm okay. Cute PJs. Oh, <laughs> thanks. They're super comfy. Molly, I thought today would be the... What? Where did all that money come from? Whoa, Molly, what is your problem? I knew it. I knew it. You, you, you have to go to jail. That's just it. What are you talking about, Molly? I thought I would take you out for ice cream today. I don't want ice cream for you. You, you, you stole that money. Molly, that's not very nice. What, what happened to you? Did you roll off the top bunk of bed and bunk your head on the floor or something? How rude. I don't know if we can be friends if you're going to be so mean. Well, well, you belong in jail because you steal the money. What are you talking about? I didn't steal that money. I got an after-school job at the grocery store. Oh, uh, I'm so, I'm so sorry, Brookie. I, okay, it's a long story, but I had this horrible dream that you broke into people's houses, stole all their money from the safe, bought a Ferrari, got new Louis Vuitton clothes, and basically, um, yeah, you were a criminal and went to jail. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> That's ridiculous, Molly. I know, it sounds ridiculous, but the dream felt really real. <laughs> like your friend would ever be a criminal. No, seriously, I, 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 I felt like it was so real. But I know, you're not a criminal. R right? Of course I'm not, Molly. I really did get a job at the grocery store. 
<laughs> now, do you want an ice cream cone or not? Yeah, sounds pretty good. I got uh, a call about someone robbing the house next door. Said they ran in here. <gasps> I know it, Pookie, it was you! It wasn't me, I, I didn't do it. Had your description, um, short brown hair, green bow. Ah, she did it! She robbed the house, she's a criminal! <laughs> I like to good my funny bone. <laughs> oh my gosh, Daisy, you got Molly so good. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> oh, that was funny. Oh, Daisy, you're so bad. <laughs> Another day of working at the diner. You'd think that it wouldn't be so bad, but it really is because there's this one customer who always comes in during my shift and she's so rude. Her name is Karen. Maybe you guys have heard of her before. Well, it looks like I'm gonna be late. I better get in there. Hello, I've been waiting for like five minutes. Where have you been? Sorry, my shift just started. Um. Let me just go clock in, and then I'd be happy to take your order. Oh, man. Karen is already up to no good. <sighs> Hi, welcome to Brooks Diner. I'm Molly, and I'll be your waitress. What can I get for you? Finally, this service here is total yuck. Uh, sorry, Karen. I, I'm trying my best, okay? I'm the only one on. Yeah, and I'm the only one in this terrible diner because nobody else wants to deal with your terrible service okay you don't have to be rude like this job is not my dream job i'm just doing it because well i i i need money okay i have car insurance and gas and you know what you have gas get away from me you're gonna smell no like gas for my car not like a fart whatever anyway all right i'll have a cheeseburger a coke and some fries and hurry up make sure the fries are fresh last time they were kind of gross Okay, fine, Karen. Ugh. She is so rude. I don't want to work here anymore. Wait a minute. That's right. I got that spell book from the library. And it had a spell in there to make a clone. Uh, this might be a bad idea, but it's feeling like it might actually be a good idea. I could make a clone, she could come do all of my work, and I could just chill out whenever I want. Hello? Hey, Molly, what's up? Oh, hey, Luke. Um, just at work right now. Ugh, I, I'm working my shift right now at the diner. Oh, you sound really sad. What's wrong? Oh, I just wish we could hang out instead. Like, I just, this job is just, it's too much, Luke. Well, everybody has to have a job, Molly. So, you know, it's not that bad, right? Okay, yeah, uh, I guess not. It's just this one customer named Karen, and she's just, like, she's kind of rude. Hello? Are you talking on your phone? Or are you getting my lunch? Gosh, you're so slow. Hurry up. Look, I have to go. Do you want to meet me in the park later? Yeah, um, I can meet you for a couple of minutes after work. Meet me at, like, 3 o'clock, okay? Okay, Molly. I look forward to seeing you. I'm so happy you're my girlfriend. Aw. That's the nicest thing I've heard all day. <laughs> Hurry up. I'm trying to wait for you but you're taking forever and i'm starving okay 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 this this looks right i think this is what she ordered here you go what i didn't order a steak potatoes and green beans i added a burger and fries oh you're so incapable of doing anything well maybe you should eat this it's it's good for you whatever i'm not eating that finally my shift is over I swear, that was the longest one of my entire life. Now I get to go to the park and see Luke. <gasps> there he is! Oh, he's so dreamy. I love him with all my heart. Molly, I'm over here. Yeah, I see you. Hey, Luke, how was your day? It was pretty good. How was yours, Molly? Um, by the look on my face, I think you can tell. That bad, huh? So bad, Luke. Do <sighs> you want some of my Doritos? Come here, sit by me. Oh, I'd love to eat some of the Doritos you have. Here you go. Mmm, they're delicious. Luke, you make me so happy. I'm glad you're my boyfriend. 
And I'm glad you're my girlfriend, Molly. Now turn that frown upside down. Luke, I will as soon as I do something, but right now I have to go home. Really? Why? We just started hanging out. You only ate like three Doritos. I'll see you tomorrow, Luke. I promise. Molly, where are you going? I thought we had a date. Tomorrow, Luke. I promise. Now, where did I put that spell book? Oh, I can't find it anywhere. Oh, man. Where did I put it? Where is it? Wait, there it is. Right on the coffee table. <laughs> Duh. Time to turn my frown upside down. It says here that all I have to do is say these words... And, well, I'll get a clone. Here we go. Alakazam! Alakadon! I'm going to have a Molly clone! Is he a clone? Where's my... Oh my god, there's my clone! Ah, that's creepy! What? No, you're a clone. I'm not a clone. Um, excuse me, but you are definitely the clone. No, you're not. I'm the clone. Yeah, that's what I just said. You're the clone. Oh, you tricked me! That's not fair. I'm a clone. I've only been on the planet a few minutes. <laughs> you look exactly like me. Except for your face looks a little grumpy. But whatever. I guess that's just part of being a clone. Okay, clone. Tomorrow you're going to go to work. And then you're going to do all my chores too. Yeah, that sounds fair. Starting with uh, the dishes. See you in the morning. Ah, got a super good night's sleep. Well, good morning, clone. My name's not clone. My name is Polly. Oh, wow. Wow, that was very original. You just took my name and changed the first letter. Well, whatever. I look like you, so I should really be called Molly. But I decided it might get kind of confusing, so I decided to call myself Polly. Good idea. I mean, clone, you're pretty smart. But then again, you do have my brain. <laughs> all right, clone. Did you do all the dishes? Absolutely. Now I have to head over to your job, right? Uh, yeah, have fun with that. <laughs> Time to relax. Well, better turn on the TV. I don't even have to have a job. My clone's doing it for me. Awesome. Oh, <laughs> this is so adorable. <laughs> Look at that dog. He looks so happy. <sighs> My first day on the police force. And I'm starving. I can't wait to have lunch. Uh, do you think you could get it right this time, Molly? I want a cheeseburger, no pickle, some fries, only 10 though, so count them. And then also, um, I want a milkshake. Uh, okay, that sounds like a lot, but I'm sure I can do it. Hurry up. Jeez, you're so slow. You know what? You're kind of rude, and I don't like that. Hmm, I wonder what's going on here. And are they going to give me a donut soon? What are you doing? What What's going on here? I don't like rude customers. That's what's going on. Oh, my gosh. Okay, you two, stop this fighting right now. Police officer, arrest her. Uh, I don't think so. Um, well, I'm not really sure I could arrest her. I'm not on duty right now. But why did you spray her with the fire extinguisher? Have you met this rude Karen? I got other things to do than have someone be rude to me all day. She got on my nerves. Well, Karen, she kind of does have a point. What? You're taking her side? She's psycho. I'm never coming back here. And I'm going to make sure you get fired with your boss. I don't care because I quit. This job stinks. But but who's going to get me a donut? I'm so hungry. Hey, Molly. <laughs> Can we have our date now? Uh, yeah, but why don't you call me Polly? And you're very handsome. Um, okay. Why did you change your name? I just like Polly better, don't you? Oh, I just like you, so I'll call you Mo Molly or Polly or whatever. Is Polly your middle name? Yeah, Molly Polly. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Just call me Polly. Okay, Polly. Um, So you want to share Doritos with me? Yeah, you're super cute. Um, So you're my boyfriend? Um, Polly, you know that I am. Oh, boy, oh, boy, I can't wait to tell Luke what I did. Maybe I can make a clone of him, too. That way, um, basically that he doesn't have to do any work anymore. Wait, wait. Is that... Is that my clone, Polly? Is she... Is she stealing my boyfriend? Oh, my God, no! This is horrible! What am I gonna do? Well, I can't let Luke see, or maybe he'll freak out that there's two of me. Well, um, Polly, let's just, like, go hang out. Maybe watch a movie or something. Sounds good. Can't wait. Did he just call her Polly? He knows... He knows she's a clone, and, 
and he likes her better than me? But, but, Luke! M Molly? Wait, 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 I'm so confused. What's, what's going on here? There's two of you! Uh, no, that one is a clone. No, I'm not! That one's a clone! Uh, what's going on? Uh. Luke, my boyfriend, are you okay? Molly, is that you or is that you? No, she said call her Polly, right? Yeah. That's because she's really Polly, my clone. Well, I'm not giving up my boyfriend. I love him. He's not your boyfriend, Polly. He's my boyfriend. Not anymore. Wait a minute. I have an idea, Luke. Luke, are you going to be okay? No. Luke, come with me. Hurry. You guys can't run away from me. Don't worry, Polly. Everything's going to be fine. Luke, I'm going to make a clone of you. Wait, what? Haven't you gotten yourself in enough trouble? Look, don't you want to be with me forever? Yeah. Well, that can't happen if Polly's here and in our way. So if I make a clone of you, she can have a boyfriend and I can have mine back. I don't think this is a good idea, Molly. Nonsense, Luke. Everything will be fine. Okay, here we go. Abracadabra. Alakazone. Let's make a Luke clone. Whoa, my clone looks almost identical to me. You mean you are almost identical to me. What? No, you're the clone. Don't forget who the clone is. Anyway, go see your girlfriend, Polly. Oh, I have a girlfriend named Polly. Yeah, that sounds right. Hi, I'm Luke. Hi, I'm Polly. Um, wait, are you the original Luke? Or are you just a clone Luke? What? No, I'm original Luke. <laughs> but you could call me Duke. Okay, well, who cares if you're a clone? I'm a clone too. I'm a clone of Molly, and my name is Polly. And I'm a clone of Luke, and my name is Duke. Well, I think we could live happily ever after. What do you think? Totally. <laughs> this is going to be so much fun taking over their lives. Ha 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 Guys, do you think it's such a good idea to, um, you know, go and rob the dollar store when we just got out of jail? I think it's a great idea. We might need a lot of the stuff that the dollar store has. Well, um, since this is just a really fun Roblox game, I think it'll be okay if we rob the if we rob the dollar store right after we get out of jail. I don't know. I didn't like jail very much. Their food tasted bleh. <laughs> I thought their food was super delicious. That's only because Molly, you'll eat anything. If you saw a dried worm on the sidewalk, you'd be like. Ooh, yum. Ew, no, I wouldn't. Take that back. Girls, we don't have time for this. We have to go rob the dollar store. Yeah, you're right. Let's go. Gonna rob the dollar store in Roblox. Gonna rob the dollar store in Roblox. Ooh, dollar store. You ever go into the dollar store and you're just like, I need one thing, a new notebook for school. And it's only going to be $1. And then when you come back out of the dollar store, you have like 10 bags and you've spent like $50. <laughs> That's the curse of the dollar store. Ooh, they've got a lot of good stuff. Hello, welcome to the dollar store. Hi, um, hey, I'm not doing anything bad right now. Oh my gosh, look at these beautiful flashlights. I need one of those. What do you need a flashlight for? Daisy, you distracted me. I got busted. Oh, I'm in jail already? <laughs> Very funny, Daisy. Very funny. I think it's hilarious. Yeah, I bet you do. Dad, what are you doing? I don't want to. Dad, don't be such a chicken. Come on. Let's rob the dollar store. But, but. No buts, Dad. You have to, you have to rob the dollar store. Your whole family's doing it. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wonder if we can steal some of these. Nah, apparently they're not worth anything. Okay, there is a lot of employees working today. Look at this guy. Okay, no one goes over here. Maybe if I stand on this cart, I could steal these brooms. Yes! Wait, I'm sitting in the cart and she can't even bust me. This is awesome! I'm literally stealing so many brooms right now. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna sell all these brooms because obviously I don't need, actually need all these brooms. Okay, here comes the lady. Okay, I'm gonna run! 
Oh my gosh, stop! Okay, run! Is there any other people that are... I just got busted, Molly! Oh, man! Daisy just got busted. Okay, I have to go sell my stuff to this criminal over here. Excuse me! $36! Whoa, those brooms are worth a lot. Dad, are you still standing outside? I, I can't do it. Dad! I'm reformed! I can't do it! Oh, brother. Oh, look at these cool sunglasses. Okay, I'll have one of those. What? No, I was inside the cart! Why did I get busted? Oh, man. Wait a minute. Ew, delicious donuts? Yes, please. Let me get rid of my sticky pirate hook hand. Hmm. These are delicious. <laughs> Wait a minute. When you're in jail, you get bunk beds? That's so cool! I didn't get bunk beds the last time I was in jail. I love Roblox, yes I do. I love Roblox, how about you? Do do do. I love Roblox, yes I do. I love Roblox, how about you? If you love Roblox, slam that like button! Come on guys, give this video a huge thumbs up! Okay, now I've gotta go rob something else. Ooh, peanut butter, one of my favorites. Can't have PB and J without that. Robbing it. Robbing it! Robbing it. Robbing it! Okay, what else can I rob? Okay, one is Jiffy and one is um Peter Pan peanut butter. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm stealing so much peanut butter right now. Just because they can't get me up here, so I'm stealing all the peanut butter. <laughs> I don't know where the rest of my family is right now. I should probably go find them, but... Let's see if I go over here. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh! She's gonna bust me! I've gotta get out of here. I've gotta go sell what I've got before I get busted. Phew, I made it out. Okay. Oh, Dad's in there. He must have stole something. I stole something, too. Not as much as I did. I stole $60 worth of peanut butter. <laughs> I have, like, so much money. $33,000, actually. Whoa, Molly, you're rich. Yeah, I totally am. Oh, potato chips. Yes, yes, I want those. Uh, do you need some help getting that off the shelf? Uh, nope, nope, I'm good. I can't, okay, I can't climb up there. We're up there, all right. Oh, there's an upstairs. Okay, we definitely need to go up there and see what they have. Let's go up the escalator. Let's go up the escalator. Okay, she goes down that one. Oh, there's somebody that's working up here too? Seriously? There's people everywhere. Let me see if I can get rid of my sticky hand pirate hook if I can climb up here. Yeah! All right, let's steal some books. Boing. Oh, yeah. I'm going to take this one, too. I wonder how much books they're worth. I have no idea. I just stole all those ones, though. OMG. Guys, don't do this in real life. This is just a fun Roblox game. Don't be a criminal for real, okay? Nobody likes the criminals. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I'm going to steal this book, too. Guys, I've sold eight things. You think I should go cash them in now? There's just people everywhere. Oh, my gosh. There's some ice cream over there. Okay, I'm going to go over there. What? No! He was looking the other way. I got busted. Oh, my gosh, Mom. Oh, I'm back in jail, Molly. Oh, Mom. I'm so sorry. But, hey, if you want, you can sleep on this top bunk bed. It's pretty cool. I don't, I don't want to be in jail. Well, it's just a... Just the thing you, you have to realize, Mom. You do the crime, you do the time. Oh, Molly. <laughs> dad? Oh, wait, no, you're not my dad. Kind of look like him, though. Dad, you're selling more stuff? Yeah, turns out I'm pretty good at being a robber. Um, I don't know if that's something to brag about, Dad. <laughs> Molly, come with me. I'm going up the stairs. Okay, but trust me, they're pretty, pretty sneaky up there. Steal all the ice cream. That's where it's all good in there. You can't steal the ice cream. Hmm. Look at all the flavors they have. Is there any more? Is, can you steal like this kind? That's stinky that you can't steal the ice cream. I want to steal the ice cream. Your Daisy's over there stealing all the scissors. Now she's like jumping down there. 
Whoa, Daisy's got a giant amount of loot in her backpack. Good job, Daisy. Good job with your thiefing. My thiefing, Molly. I just want to jump on these shelves because if you do, they can't get you. Oh, yeah, I did it. Okay, I think these are mirrors. I'm going to steal those. Maybe. Stealing some scissors. I don't know how much they're going to be worth. I think they should be worth like $3 a piece, probably. Molly, leave some scissors for me to steal. No way. I can't steal the scissors. I'm stealing all the scissors. I see them, Molly, every single one, right? Yeah, and a couple mirrors, too. I, I think this is like the place where the hairdresser goes for all her stuff. Because, look, there's mirrors here and scissors. You could be right, Molly. You could be right. Okay, now I have to try to jump. Oh, I made it past that. Oh, my gosh. They're coming at me. This way, Molly. Oh, this is the most loot I've ever had. I have 10 right now. Dad, you're cashing in again? Yeah, I told you I'm super good at, at being a criminal. $150. That's the most money I've ever made. Okay, I'm going to rob the dollar store one more time. What should I take? Definitely the tips of something, Molly. Takes forever to rob this place, though. Oh, my gosh. Look at all these candy bars. I don't even want to cash these in. I just want to eat them myself. Molly, you're supposed to cash them in. Mmm. But they're so tasty. Mmm, they're delicious. Oh, my gosh. This guy might catch me right now. Oh, he did! Oh, I wasn't actually expecting him to. Mom? Oh, I can't believe it. I'm in the big house. I'm in prison. Mom, you can just walk out the door. Oh, really? I can? Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Mom. We've got a lot more dollar stores to rob. How about this one, baby Kira? Look at it. It's got cute little pandas. You like this one? I love it, but not as much as I love Mr. Monkey. Yeah, Mr. Monkey is super adorable. <laughs> Ooh, I'm super hungry. Me too. I wonder when dinner's going to be ready. Mom, Mom, what are we having for dinner? Oh, you're going to be so happy, Molly. We're having one of your favorites, tacos. Seriously, tacos? Oh, this day just got amazing. Um, I'm going to go back and watch TV until it's ready, okay, Mom? Sure, Molly, no problem. Thanks, Mom. I love the little monkey. Let's go see Mom and what she doing. She's making dinner, baby Kira. Yeah, but I miss my mommy. I want to see her. Mama, I'm thirsty. Can I have a bottle of milk? Of course you can, sweetie, but just don't drink too much of it. I don't want you to spoil your dinner. We're having tacos. I love tacos. It's so good. Mm. I just remembered I have to switch over the laundry. Be right back, sweetie. I put a little bit of milk in the taco, make it taste better. <laughs> a little bit in this taco, a little bit in this one too. I put milk in all the tacos. <laughs> Are you serious? The baby panda lost its mom? <laughs> this was the worst show ever. I changed my mind. Well, Molly, good thing we're eating tacos for dinner. That'll cheer you up. I don't think anything can cheer me up after that show. Oh, that was so sad. <laughs> I'm a bit dramatic. I'm not dramatic. Okay, maybe a little baby, Kira, but that, that was so sad. Girls, time for dinner. Yeah. Mwah. Mm. I don't know what you did to the tacos this time, but mm, they're better than ever. <laughs> what, baby Kira? Nothing. I didn't do anything different, Molly. You must just be extra hungry. <laughs> Can I have another one? Sure, Molly. Mm. You really do like the tacos. Mm -hmm. mm. Delicious. Ten minutes later. Ugh, my stomach feels kind of ouchy. Oh, Molly, are you okay? Did you eat too much? No. Uh, it's okay. She just has to fart because she ate too many tacos. This happens. Huh, what? No, I don't. <clears throat> okay, yeah, maybe I do a little. Uh, no, no. Gotta run to the bathroom. Uh, Molly, are you gonna be okay? I hope so. Uh. 
Ah, uh -huh. oh, what was wrong with those tacos? Oh, my gosh. Oh, no. Oh. <sighs> okay, a little bit better. Wait a minute. Where's the toilet paper? Seriously? Did I just go to the bathroom and there's no toilet paper? There's gotta be some somewhere here, right? No? No? Uh-oh. This is so embarrassing! I need toilet paper! Who used up all the toilet paper? Mom, we're out of toilet paper! Oh no! Okay, Molly, well, there's probably some in the upstairs bathroom, but there's some baby wipes in there. What? I'm not a baby, Mom! I don't need to use baby wipes! Molly, it's fine. Just use the baby wipes. Ugh. Oh, Molly, are you okay? I don't know. What'd you put in those tacos anyway? I didn't put anything different in. I ate up with your milk in. Wait, what? You put milk in the tacos? Uh -huh, I put it from my baby bottle. But, 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 but! Oh, baby Kira. Molly's allergic to dairy. She's lactose intolerant. Uh oh. Oh no. Here it comes again. Okay, I'm gonna use the upstairs bathroom because there's no toilet paper down here. Oh, gotta run, 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 gotta run, run, gotta run, 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 gotta run to the bathroom. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Okay, I made it. Oh, I'm she. Oh, can't believe she put milk in my taco. Oh, okay, better. All right, where's the toilet paper? Seriously? There's no toilet paper anywhere in this house! Mom! Molly, is everything okay in there? No! There's no toilet paper anywhere in this house! Oh, good thing I put a little bit of um, baby wipes under the sink. <laughs> in case I had to change baby Kira's diaper. Well, Mom, do I look like I'm one years old? I mean, come on, where's the toilet paper? Uh, sounds like we need to go grocery shopping. Ugh, you think? Gee, Molly, how's your stomach feeling? It feels like a volcano erupted in my stomach. Or like someone poisoned me with milk. Oh, geez, I'm sorry about that. She's just a baby, Molly. She didn't know any better. Holy guacamole. Well, good thing that the grocery store has a bathroom. <laughs> yeah, and maybe they actually have toilet paper. Oh, how embarrassing. Well, Molly, it could be worse. You could eat another taco. <laughs> Uh-huh, very funny, Daisy, very funny. You should be so grateful you're not lactose intolerant. <clears throat> Ooh, Molly, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. <clears throat> really? It doesn't sound like you're fine. Are you sure? She's got enough gas that we don't have to stop in the gas station for any. <laughs> oh, man, yeah, crack jokes at my expense, sure. <clears throat> uh, Molly, maybe you should wait in the car. No! I'm making sure that we have all the supplies needed at the house from now on. Molly, don't you think you're a little bit too old to be riding in the car? Hey, you're the one that put me in here. No, I didn't. Yes, yes, Mom. Yes, you did. Oh, well, I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. Get out of the car. Seriously, I can't push it. You're too heavy. Fine. I'm going to go over to the Dorito section. Are you sure your stomach feels good enough for that? <sighs> no. I just want to hide out over here. Okay, now, let's see. we got to get the essentials. Molly, what on earth are you doing? I'm getting the giant mega roll of toilet paper. We are never running out again. <laughs> you look ridiculous. Maybe you should wear that costume for Halloween. Oh, very funny. Pick on the lactose intolerant girl. <laughs> but you're literally wearing the toilet paper. How many rolls is that, a hundred? <laughs> Hey, well, you know what? We're never going to run out again. Ugh, I just got to move this over to the cart. Mom, mom. What, Molly, what are you doing? That's a lot of toilet paper. I'm not even sure we have room in the cart for it. We have room. We have room, see? <laughs> oh, man. We don't have room for milk or eggs or chips or um, anything else. <laughs> we just have room for toilet paper. <laughs> hey. I don't ever want you guys to be in the situation I was just in. It's not fun, people! It's not fun! Oh, Molly, I'm sorry you're having such a bad night. I know taco night is normally so, so fun for you. Okay, we can pick up a pizza for tomorrow night. We need some more fruit. I need some more milk. I put it all in my taco. <laughs> oh, my. You put all of your milk on Molly's taco. Oh, you naughty little baby. Yeah! 
Very funny that you put all your milk in my taco. Remember, baby Kira, Molly can't have milk, okay? So don't do that again. Oh my gosh, she should be grounded for life. Wow, Molly Hoss. She's just a little baby. I mean, look at her cute little innocent face. Yeah, so innocent. Besides that, behind that pacifier, she's probably making evil little faces. Oh boy, Molly. You really have gone insane. Molly, how's your stomach feeling, honey? Oh, well, it feels like I have to run to the bathroom again. Oh, good thing we bought all that toilet paper. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. I feel like the bathroom and I are becoming BFFs. Wait. W -w -w Wait. Where's all the toilet paper? We bought like a hundred rolls and there's none up here? Uh, Mom! Mom! Wait, what? 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 What are you doing? I love Halloween. I'm the mummy. Did you wrap yourself in toilet paper, baby Kara? Uh-huh. A hundred rolls of it. <laughs> I swear it took to make this Halloween costume. Are you serious right now? You used all the toilet paper to make a Halloween costume? 